Anywho, hello everyone. Back to Fallout. Our favorite. Fallout 3. Mm-mm. Yeah, I would get me some of that Fallout 3. Let's just get closer to the screen. Like they advise on the television. Okay. Hail. I'm really doing much there. The enclave seems to have AVF problem. Welcome, brother. Recent experiments with accelerated vector fusion. Uh, AV, A, AVF, American's Funniest Home Videos, um, have not gone accordingly, according to plan. All scribes assigned to the lab should check with Scribe Rothschild on the daily basis, on daily basis, and obtain any modified technical parameters as needed. Warning, leaky hydraulics. It has come to our attention that several scribes have slipped on hydraulic fluid near the eastern end of the robot lift. Until the comp until the offending pipes have been mended completely, please use caution in that area to the eastern. We've developed advanced plasma-based weaponry. I need to analyze our power. Let's see if that's anywhere here. Hello. Wow. Look, I like the Iron Giant too, okay? No. Maybe it's- maybe there's a meme somewhere, but I don't see any, like, little do not slip here cones anywhere near here. It's not good, Todd. Not environmental enough for me. Need something, friend? Well, do you need something in here? Ooh, actually. Why is this- why? What pervert works at Bethesda? Beside Todd. Enclave technical assessment. Weapons, plasma based, capable of. Oh, there's a. I kept my controller on my thigh! Fuck me! <laughs> Sorry, I was playing party animals before this. Ah, <sighs> play that with controller. Capable of molecular. Destabilization, armor, advanced power armor, mark two, transportation, vert vert ibirds. Technical assessment, the enclave forces that have occupied Project Purity are nearly identical to those encountered on the west coast in the year 2241. Third potential, severe GNR battle after action report. It is the opinion of several Sentinel Lion that the recent super mutant attack on Gen GNR was not indicative to a larger assault as was originally thought. Instead, the forces that attacked the radio station were probably en route to the mall to reinforce their own kind in the prolonged battle against the mercenaries of Talent Company. Talent Company! General Robotic... General Robot Diagnostics. Updated. Scrub Rothschild has completed a new full diagnostic of the robot. Here are those results. Mobility, 0%. Navigation... Translation, 0%. Internal processors, 87%. Weapon system, 60%. Power management, 3%. Voice modular, 100%. <laughs> Thank goodness. We, we know that's going to work. Voice, uh, voice mod module. Uh, you know, percent is modulo, right? That's I think that's the operator. Use that between numbers to get the remainder. Use that in computer science all the time. Um, it is an assessment of Scribe, it is the assessment of Scribe Rothschild that once the power management issues are solved, mobility and navigation translation will jump to at least 50%, well within acceptable operating capacity. Notice, Redden funeral up cancelled, oh, due to certain unexpected technical developments, funeral services for initiate Redden have been cancelled. A moral service will be scheduled at in uh sometime in the future t day t b d okay prime operations welcome scribe rothschild historical records project summary classified as only military contract three eight nine one seven code name liberty prime uh eight seven 
75309. Project goal, no less than the creation of the most powerful combat robot the battlefield has ever seen, with the express goal of liberating occupied Anchorage, Alaska, from the Chinese aggressors. Summary, the United States Army has succeeded in contracting both Robco and General Atomics International to work on their first joint project. Speaking of joint project... The robot they created, Liberty Prime, will be the very embodiment of America, milita American military might. Walking, talking, iron giant, nuke-tossing robot uh, hero. Or remind the world what it means to be a superpower. <laughs> I'm certain, I am fully confident that the presence of Liberty Prime at the Anchorage front line will be to the Chinese. What? Oh no, I'm not going to finish that. Um, General Constantine Chase. G great summary kit, Chase. Capital Post article, June 3rd, 2072. By Walter. Just, oh. Hold on. Oh, this is perfect. Hold on. Okay. Um by Walter Street Beat Monroe, Capital Post staff writer. I think I, rem I remember him from a different thing. Um, by the way, in this house, we we salute, we stand and salute when Walter is present. That is a flag I can get behind. Um, but if you don't know this meme dog, he's been known as Walter. And this picture is known by like like how you look when your front facing camera turns on or whatever it's like an old meme but god i love that bull terrier it's so cute i follow them on twitter uh yeah capital post staff writer in the startling turnaround from their previous policy to completely convert uh policy of complete covert development yeah the united states has confirmed that they indeed working on yep i think i've read this one already they're just being upfront about that they have a big weapon they're going to use. Letter, Dr. Bloomfield to General Chase. Ooh. Taking a sip, sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, General Chase, but you're being completely unrealistic. There's simply no way the robot will be combat ready in three months. Is this, is this like the staff talking about Talking about Todd Howard promising things. The chassis, the chassis, is completely, the chassis is complete. All weapon systems are online, and the voice module has been programmed as requested. But power consumption is still our primary concern. Wow, even back then. And neither Dr. Honeywell nor Park have yet found an acceptable solution. We had hoped to subcontract Voltec and utilize the talents of Dr. Braun. Oh boy, well uh. <laughs> They're a little preoccupied, uh, but apparently he's gone into seclusion, working on one of their own projects, and they couldn't reach him at the this point if they wanted to, so that's out. I'll give it your I'll give it to you straight, General. This is the biggest robot in the world the world has ever seen, and we just haven't been able to find a power source small enough and powerful enough to get the damn thing running with all its systems online. In three months, we might be able to guarantee the robot can walk down into downtown Anchorage, but all his weapon systems will be offline. <laughs> Maybe he can just step on the red... Uh, <laughs> Thanks, Stanley Bloomfield, project lead. Project lead. Diagnostic reports. Yeah, this is in order. Uh, May 8th, 2077. It's pretty recent. Processor system. Rothschild is confident that redistributing power from pa from weapons and mobile subsystems 
we're able to bring the power management to at least 70, 67% enough to successfully carry out a full activation sequence. July 13th, Sarah Rothschild has completed a new full diagnostics, diagnosis, prognosis. Oh, it's gotten worse. It's been determined that the recent feedback spike, which resulted in overall system de degradation, uh, has in fact caused is it caused by the installation of the new power capacitor, as Scribe Rothschild suspected. Till further notice, Scribes are ordered to cease any and all experiments that involve the reroute of power from any of the robot's subsystems. Current. Yeah. It's, pretty, it's the current one. Saw that up before. Lead Scribes Journal. Oh boy, get to... Oh. Oh boy. Ooh. I get to just I just get to read things all stream. Oh boy. Oh, it's my favorite. Uh Citadel System Link 39L. Okay. Okay, that's a lot of L's to take. May 9, 27 uh Oh, excuse me. Another day, another setback. We had tried, of course, rerouting power from weapons to the robots other subsystem several times. Each attempt ended in failure, thanks to the robots overall. No really aggressive combat subroutines, okay. It's almost as if there's some hidden pocket of AI that keeps pushing against us, refusing to let anyone drain power from its ball syst weapon systems. I guess that shouldn't surprise me, considering why he was constructed in the voice place. That's why I began work on the neural dampener in the first place. I was convinced, first place, first place. I was convinced, good writing. I was convinced I could trick the robot into thinking it. I had actually redistributed the power from some other s subsystem. It's a good theory, but damn thing proved smarter than that, certainly smarter than me. All I managed to do was fry some of his circuitry again and set ba us back another three months, damn. Not three months later, July 14th. I'm tired of trying to reroute power like some kind of snot-nosed initiate. I don't care what yet's yeah, fair. Feels like an unelegant way of doing something. Which would be pretty newbie. I don't care what kind of drain it puts on the scribe's ability to research and maintain the weapons and armor. I'm proceeding with the AVF experiments. We heard about those earlier. If I can successfully create an accelerated vector fusion module, similar to the technology I saw Dr. Lee working on with all uh, working with all those years ago, we'll have the first real chance of operating the robot fully operational. May, uh, whatever. We'll have our first real chance of getting the robot fully operational. Maybe then the Western elders will realize our worth. Oh god. July, August 1st! Fortunately, the accelerated vector fusion... AVF experiments haven't gone as planned. Uh, but Bodewitch suffered second degree burns, and at one point we accidentally channeled so much power that the robot's head laser it discharged and nearly killed the other lions. He was not pleased. Okay. Voice emitter test initialized. Oh shit. pretty low for me too. See why he's not working? There's nothing in his head. He's all hollow. Initiate activation sequence. Failure. Insufficient power. Wow. Well, you don't say. Where's lions? Where am I going? Keep talking about those extra places I want to go, so let's do that first. Just step outside so we get like a free, uh, a free save. 
Don't want to clutter my save files now. Okay. Keep talking about these damn places. Also, thank you, Walter. You've, you've served your purpose. Okay. By the way, that thing I shared, that, that like, Walter in front of the American flag, apparently, <laughs> where I got that from was the, uh, was the, the like, Amazon listing for a f an actual flag you can buy. Okay, so we're going to Cratered Hamlet. Hamlet. Located just south of a certain train yard, it says. Okay. Oop. Good. Near Agatha's house. Okay. Looks like it's right there. Oh god. It's happening. It's going down. Nice. Give me your meat. Good. Okay, I was minimizing something. It's minimizing all those tabs, you know. People in the back know what I'm talking about. Whoa. Of course. Is that a critter? Critter? Nope, okay. Oh, thought there was another critter. There we go. Let's do this. Nice. I guess I'll start using these more, right? Medex, Psycho, good. Oh. Don't know if that was audible. I just quit out of that, but I got a message. Just look at that on my phone instead. Yay. Like getting messages from the person I got a message from. Known as Maple. That's right. Okay, we're here at the crater. Wow. Scenic. I think we were here before, too. What's over there? Saw something moving. Oh, it's a scorpion. Mm, I love when you can see the radiation in the air. Yeah, looted that already. I never got the other loot that was here. It's not too important that I get this, but just wanted to do it for completion's sake. Dun, 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 dun. I think I see the place where it is. In front of me. Took a bunch of my rat medicine too. My chems. Just want to make sure we get use out of those now that we have them quick quick bind. Yeah. Tumblers today. That was the thing I was looking for. It's only notable loot here, really. We'll still scavenge, because, you know, raccoon. Very raccoon coated. Get us some mailbox stuff? Nope. Okay. I wish. Oh. Got a Nuka Cola truck. I don't know if he sees me. I don't think he does. Good. Watch this. Let's get some sneak attack damage. 
Oh my god, instant death. <laughs> World of Warcraft parody funny or crazy. <laughs> I like your username. What if Fallout but real life? That would be scary. And and I'd and I'd be upset. Um <laughs> But you could loot mailboxes, finally! <laughs> okay, well, maybe there is some upsides actually. You're starting to make sense there. <laughs> That's a good point. I did not consider that. Look at all these ovens I can just, you know, steal all the pilot lights from, too. There's so many perks of <laughs> the apocalypse. All these safes that were safe from the blasts. I keep getting that, like, letter from vault -Tec. Yeah. It doesn't really, uh, never adds to my stuff. Revelations 21.6, I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. I will give unto him, that is, a thirst of the fountain of the uh, the water of life freely. A lot of the Bible is written like that, where it's like, like written for word count. Like, I, look, okay, so let's, let's edit this down. Like, let's do this like an English teacher would. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. Okay, how can we lower the word count here? I'll give him the water of life. I'll give him water of the fountain of life freely. If you're thirsty, bro, I'll give you water from the fountain. Oh, but it has to be of life. Like, okay, maybe the Bible was onto something. We tried our best to to reduce the word count there at the at the the writing rec center or whatever. Remember in college there was like a uh, like an like a service they had where you can get your papers reviewed by an actual human, a real life human, not just a not just a chat GB or a T. This poor scorpion didn't deserve this. Oh, he's so cute, though. Look at the little pincers. I never saw them, like, move before. Little inner pincers. Oh, he knows I'm here. Oh, well. Sorry, guy. Sorry I had to end like that. Okay, well, we saw that crater. And we actually went there in a previous episode, but we never finished looting. There's a few places like that. Where we haven't finished looting. Lubing. Hold on, getting getting a premonition. Remove that. Let me uh, give us a little, little safety save. Then we'll do a safety dance. A safety dance. Uh, okay, Crater Hamlet. Done. Bannister Crater, though. There's actually alien power cells there. That's a rare item. Next to Fort Bannister. Who would have thought? Who would have thunk it? I didn't do shit. <laughs> okay. Uh, little lamp light. Little lamp wick. Uh, I had no clue where this place is actually. Okay, it's. Yeah. 
Yeah. Okay, I've never been to Fort Bannister, actually. Let's go to Fort Bannister first, I guess, and then we'll go to the, the crater that's next to it. The crater is, like, here. Or, it's actually here. And that's Fort Bannister. Oh god, they are already spawned back. Great. I jumped instead of hiding. <laughs> Oops. Uh, nope, too late. <laughs> well, okay. Let's put on some actual armor for once. Let's just make everyone lose the ability to walk. No. Let's see what this. Out of context, that doesn't sound too good. Oh, frag. So the dart rifle in this game does a thing. Breaks your legs. R.I.P. Oh, he's a friend, right. Great, that's cool. That's the first time I've experienced the friend perk. I've never gotten that in an actual game. Oh. Your time. This gun has a weird glitch sometimes. Ow. Oh, I got him. Pog. Nice chunky magazine sound. Oh. Mmm. -hmm. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, God. Scorpion, save me. No, not the cow. Fucker. drug I can. I ate Yao Guai meat. <laughs> Come on. There. The glitch that this gun does is just like, it'll just look like I'm firing but not actually fire out bullets. It's pretty annoying. I should add buff out to my list of uh, chems that I take because it gives me 60 plus health which is pretty useful. I'm also impervious to landmines right now. We'll never trip them. Is there another cow? There is. Nope. Just that one. Yay! They're back! Now they can eat all the stuff I left them last time. Best outcome. Okay. Can I... I want to give them health. Let's look up how do I give people health in Fallout. Fallout. Three. Console. Command. Heal. Yeah. PC. Reset health. Cool. Back to health. Up. Oh, this one looks smaller. And also, they they're fully healed too. Good. <coughs> you stay like that. Let's see if there's anything up here. Don't know if I actually looked up here last time. I didn't, and there was nothing up here. It's over there. Oh, I've been there before. That's where I saw my pa. Wow. What a beautiful skyline. 
I don't know what you, you, you know, you can say whatever you want about Fallout, but you can't say it's ugly. It's beautiful. Every single part of it is beautiful. Okay, this sucks. It's not the DPS that we want. Come on. Yeah, that's, this shotgun is necessary if I'm going to take on uh, rad scorpions. Time is it? Oh, it's good. Morning. Woo. Oh. It's brawling going down here. Oh, it's the Brotherhood. They can do their thing. Whatever. All these silly robots that are just out here in the wild for no reason. I guess it makes sense here because we're getting close to a uh, military base. I feel like that's in lore to have robots near those. Ah, nice refreshing dip in the pool. It's so nice. It's like a warm jacuzzi. Oh, they're still plowing through here. Okay. Yeah, do all the work for me. I'm not going to help them out. Meat? That one company? I wonder if any other meat was here. No, I don't see any. Where is this coming from? Are they shooting at me? No? Oh, is that Talon Company? Yep. Fort Bannister. I guess it's a Talon Company place. I ate everything. Oh, and let's, uh... Add some buff out to this list. Okay. Oops. Ah. Uh, game crashed. It's okay. We'll be back in a sec. I made sure to save before I minimized. It's become a very good force of habit. Shit. I'm all cammed up right now. Please die. There. Goodbye. Real question is, where did all that where the Brotherhood stuff go? Hi, dog. There he is. Oh god, what's going on behind me? Okay. They sure are talent company. Nice, got their, uh... Sniper. Talent company. Talent company included. <laughs> Tempted to use the sniper. Oh, it's out of ammo. Out of durability. Yeah, you want to have a laser fight? Goodbye. Oh, something here. Yep. Wonder what I, I was just so curious what that sound could be. I wonder what makes that sound.
I was wondering why my deep my damage on my guns looks so high. It's because uh oh he's protecting me. Oh my FOV is so low now. There we go. I have so much red scorpion barks on me. Aw, rip. Not rip though. Don't really care for these guys that much. I think I have some of their armor already. How much how much would it weigh? Um my hide or did it disappear? What? What? Okay, I guess he disappeared. Whatever. It's fine. I dissed him anyway, so... It's okay. Oh. Let's see if he disappears if I... Nope, he's still there, I guess. Sorry about your brother. I'm so curious where that body went. Just gone. Absconded. Hmm, that doesn't look that good over there, that texture. Well, it sure was a fort. It sure was a fraught. Um, sure, some battery I can drop. Yep. Let's see this floating? Oh no, it didn't float this time. Ooh, it's actually a fort here. Nice. Cool. We'll go down there in a minute. Don't you worry, chat. Uh, there's also that beacon I want to try. Right, that's where I got the battery. Upgrade another one. Cool. Ooh, very easy. I didn't have to t TCL my way up here. Oh. Oh, I thought that was a real guy. That's good. Good scarecrow. Worked on me. I did see the scorpion. Looks like we're not messing with each other. Yes, we are. Cow. Oh, this place I can't activate. Okay. But it's one of the towers I can activate. Hmm. -mm. Little shack. Worth looking into, I guess. I'll uh, just teleport back here, I guess. Yeah, that makes sense. I'll first check out the tower. Whoa, just phase through that. Check out that shack first. I'll teleport back. There's the crater next to this port that I'm going to check out later. Okay. Let's just do some of this. Enjoy the loot forever. Box. Okay. See how accurate my marker was. Oh, and there's also a place I can discover near here. Cool. Let's do that. pretty on the money. Oh, great. I need to drop that now. Thank you for the mine. Whoa, nine.
Can't help myself. Oh. Oh boy. It's frenzying. Goodbye. Oh, poor guy. It's pretty silly how he fell over. Oh, thank goodness the game audio's been on this whole time. Thank the bejeebus. Just trying to see what's coming up, what this location might be. Can't tell yet. See no hostiles. See that clipping thing over there? It's Z fighting. I'm guessing they plastered that on. Oh. Whoa, this is a neat little situation. Looks like they just put that on that sign recently. Rebuilding America's future. Oh, it's a national campground. Okay. Building America's future today. Is there anything here? Oh god, it's a super meowtant place. Of course it is. Meowtant. Okay, let's do this. Should be fun. Oh, it's not super meowtant, it's a uh, raider. Come on, can we get one successful pickpocket? Lots of skulls. Damn it. Ha! You. Well, they were successful, I guess. Good for them. Oh, yes, it worked. Oh, shit! <laughs> Uh, I guess they kind of have a vague understanding of I'm here now, I guess. Goodbye. Cool. Yeah, I wonder if she pickpocketed the one off that guy. That just exploded somehow. Sugar bomb. Yes. Oh my gosh. Where's that one? Lots of, uh loot for building things here. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Holy shit. Going blind with all the sugar bomb. What's happening out there? Oh, I see. Have fun, you guys. Bye. Guess they weren't expecting that victory. Okay. There's another location over here. Heh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yep. Just doing that thing we do. Fuck it. So many sugar bombs in one place. Who's this? Raider. Is that one quest we haven't done yet? With the uh, antagonist and the mechanist or whatever. And I think I'm going to side with the ant person because their melee weapon... Apparently is one of the highest DPS weapons in the game. They get like a knife that has this like bleed effect. It does like 40 damage of bleed over 10 seconds. And it stacks, so by like your fifth swing you'll be like doing, you know, an outstanding amount of damage. 
preposterous amount of damage in that, in, in fact. Okay, I know there's those two mutants over there. Tempting. But they can just chill while I go to this new location. Save every two seconds. Don't trust these rocky terrain. This rocky terrain. Oh, little tower over there. Might be a new one. Let's see. Doesn't seem new to me. Oh, we're going to vault. 187. Okay, or 87. Okay. Right, I remember it being like a mutant haven. Getting to the vault. There's no real reason for me to do this, actually. So we're going to be going the lamplight route, but, I mean, whatever. We're here. Might as well experience it. Hi. I'll never get past this gate. Nope. They'll never suspect. A thang. No way. I can. Away from there. Cool. Goodbye. I never thought I could successfully do that on a super mutant. That's cool. Oh, here goes those radiation levels. Let's uh, actually do this for once. I have so much of it. Do I need right away? I can't tell because I'm invisible. Um, nah, fine. I forgot you can take radix from that screen too. Whoa. Lots of boys in these mountains. Oh my god, the radiation levels. Oh my god. I- oh my god, that was scary. Oop. Okay. Let's see what this is like for a quick sec. Oh my god, the radiation. Oh my god! <laughs> it's so high. Forgot it gets that intense. I'm like tempted to go god mode to get to go through here for a sec. Tip. Don't mind me. Oh, it's an overlord. Should have pickpocketed. <laughs> Favorite pastime, folks. Ha! What was that? Arm hurt. <laughs> Love silent weapons. Ah. Goodbye. Retreat to the safety of the radiation. The moment. The unagros, I'm gonna vets. Something there. Come on. Something there. Okay, never mind then. I guess it's too late to apologize. Oh, there we go. Come on, fire damage. What was that? Aww, so close. Oh, a mini nuke. Cool. 
Okay, this feels like the game Stalker. Because it feels like I'm getting close to these things called anomalies every time I get really high radiation. Oh my god. Oh, I can't move. I'm dying from radiation too quickly. Oh, I'm over encumbered. Should have should have noticed. So many sugar bombs. No oh, hi. No. Ow. Oh, great. It was just it had to be the overlord. Whatever. Let's do this. I got him for. There we go. Oh god. Uh, come on. My god. All right. Well, that's happening. Uh, let's do a quick save here. Um, it's not GMT. Oh, TGM. There we go. It's toggle god mode, not god mode toggle. Let's see what happens if my, yep, my radiation levels are going high, but it's not killing me. Oh, and then, uh, so why not? Vault 87. I should not be here. Wow. <laughs> right away and Wow. Oh, and it's inaccessible either way. Okay. Well, neat. I killed these guys legitimately. So that's good to see at least. Feel good about that. See what happens if I toggle god mode now. Will it kill me? Nope. Didn't die of radiation. Good. Oh, I saved there. So let's... I'm curious. What happens if I... Will I die? Nope. It puts me here. Surprisingly. Yep. Okay. Nate. Back to fort. Wow, where was that? How did I even get here? Oh, here it is. Fort. Forting and screaming. Oh, not bad. Cups, cars. Every good fort needs both. Good, good. Nice. Good good little locker full of beer and wine. Glad survived. More wine. This place is pretty good. I like this place. That robot keeps making me jump jump scaring me. Keep thinking it's actually still here. Still with us. Let's go to the fort first, I guess. Or is it the... I guess we're gonna do the, uh... 
the crater first, because we're here. I think this is the crater. It looks like one. I mean, it smells like one, too. Can I give him quite the start? Oh, is this a special guy? Looks like... Nope. Let's see if we can uh, give him a little, you know, glow gift. Good. Tch. Rip. Oops. Take that back, sir. I will take that. Oh, can't even repair that right now. Uh, can I repair you? Cool. Want to repair that other gun with that? Entrance to the commanding officer's quarters. Ooh. Okay. Oh, a talent company, it looks like. Wondering who. Oh, see these landmines? I would have been tripping. I am, in fact, not tripping. Hell yeah. Does not notice the beeping stops. Okay, poor guy. Oh, no. Oh, what a horrible reality to live in. Or that can just happen to you. Okay, I'll need to be silent now because these guys can hear each other. Uh, you. One hit, though. Probably. Yep. Should not be legal. Thank God this isn't legal. Oh, nice grenades. Grenade. I have a problem, okay. Can't help myself. This raccoon has gr greed syndrome. Uh oh. Never won't find me. Nope, good luck getting to me. This guy won't find me. Nope. <laughs> he thinks. Come out, come out, wherever you This Okay. <laughs> Shouldn't find that as funny as I do. Drop. That's horrible. I can't look at that. There. It's that see-through pit boy. Just does not look good. Till just can't read what's going on half the time. Okay. We'll have to make sacrifices here. I think I'll come back after I sell all my junk. Because, uh, this place isn't going anywhere. Ah, <laughs> so much wine. Okay, I'll take the wine. I know I can sell that. Let's turn into vinegar now. But I'm sure people have use for vinegar in the apocalypse. Oh, this isn't even the crater. I think the crater's here. If I'm not mistaken. Let's put that there as a reminder. Vault, vault. I haven't gone to this vault yet. Should try 
checking that out soon. That'd be fun. Yeah, you need something? Yeah. I think I'll do the the thing too. You'll see what I mean. Do the thing part two. Um. What's going on? Where am I withdrawing from? Okay, well, that's fine. Repair that one gun. Yep. Nope. It's a good gun. Really huge magazine. I like that about it. Is there anything else I want to put away? I guess I want to put this away. Prepare the other thing with it. Oh man. Good. It appears you've been wounded, so may I suggest suggest a hearty nap. It's a good suggestion, Codsworth. Always thinks the infirmary, but he never thinks nap. Don't know why. Both are pretty effective. Uh. Gosh, 20. 28 of those or whatever. Um. Irma. Yerma. Oh, yes, the thing I want to do. Shoot, let's do that first, actually. Oh, we're here already. <laughs> Has to do with bobbleheads. Some grub. Try the brand. Looking to trade? Hi. Please, enjoy my selection of high-quality problem solvers. Problem solvers. Good. Uh, snipers, cool. Yeah, I'll sell those. They're fun to. Oh, well, I'll sell most of them. No. Keep six of them. Good. Definitely need to sell and repair stuff. Give me a. Sh yep. Yep, yep. Please enjoy my selection of high quality problem solvers. Good. Near the wine could sell for a little bit. Oh, hell yeah, these things. Well, there's nine of them. Hmm. Can I buy some more ammo off you, please? Okay, we're pretty light now. Holding on to nine of these still, but it could be worse. It could be much worse. Okay. For the safety of my home and for my own recollection, we're gonna go here. And if I'm holding on to the lucky ball, I'm gonna put it down for now. Welcome home, I think I am. Oh wait, actually no, I should hold on to that, because I don't have the luck one yet. Okay, never mind. Uh... Okay. Let's see what my... special looks like. What's going on here? 
alcohol. Oh. Still? How long does alcohol last? There we go. Strength, perception, intelligence, agility. Okay. All three council command. Special. Stats and character. For the special one. It is eluding me at the moment. Set a value. Where's the example? Here we go. No. Here we go. Mod AV. Cool. So. I'm going to do this to permanently upgrade myself as if I waited to get these bobbleheads until now because it feels right. And because I'm a little cheater. Um, let's see. Whoopsie. Toasty. Perception and agility. Cool. So luck is at 10 because I have the 8 ball with me. But when we get the bobblehead for that, I'll increase that to 10. Well, no, actually I won't have to. All the rest of them will naturally happen. So that's cool. Just want to get the endurance and the charisma one. And the lucky boy. Cool. Oh, hello, gnome. It's pretty pog. All at 100. Rip. I can't, uh... Don't have enough caps to add another perk yet. Sure could if I really want to. If I really wanted to, I could just sell a bunch of junk. Don't really feel like it. Yeah, I'm half tempted to do this for fun, so I think I will. We're doing it. Uh, 24. 24. Let's put these away. Let's do a bunch of this fun stuff this time. Hmm. I feel like I can, I can sell these, to be fair. Sell 14, 19 of them. I want to sell a bunch of these, too. Sell them for, uh, 26 of them. Cool. That's it, we're, we're cleaning out. Going well with you today, sir. Cleaning it all out for now, if we can. Okay, first on the list. The most important one. 
making some wonder meat. Oh, hi. Good time to hide. Where are they attacking? Yeah. Rare when I hear that dialogue. Okay, they're all just grouping up because they're friends. Guess that was a scorpion. Yeah. See this guy a lot in this group. Yep. All three of them were the same guy. What happened? Well, it's a bunch of free loot. I didn't have to actually do that encounter. Did this place respawn? I think it might, which would be pretty lame. I have to like sneak my way through it if it respawned. I feel like dungeons don't respawn, but it's so rare when I actually go back to them. Doesn't seem like it did. I like the music playing down here though. Yay, they're still here. Pumpkin. Doing this 24 times. There's no quick way of doing this. I need to keep moving my mouse down every time. Everyone be jealous of my Wonder Meat collection. I'm gonna try learning the console command now to just teleport home. This would be a good time to. Yeah, it works. COC. Okay, how about... Megaton home. Oh God, is it really all these numbers? Okay, let's try this. Did not work. Oh. How about... It worked. Megaton player house. Wow. Was a good time to use that. It would have been annoying to walk all the way back. Good to know for the future. Megaton Player House. Just COC there. Oh, is there people here? There isn't. Thought there'd be Talon Company. Still getting the Wonder Meat. Wow. So, what did you bring me? Lots of sugar bomb. Keep it moving, me. I sure am. So, what did you bring? Nice. Enjoy the gland.
It's not the first time I've said that. Oh. Or just like the laser rifle. Another sad. Nice. Yeah, while well, we're addicted to this. Check this out. Uh, what's the name of the place? Uh, Fallout 3 Vampire Location. Um... Service tunnel? Oh, it is called the metro station. Okay. Technical is Meristi Metro 02. Okay, let's try that. Hog. I just blinked my eyes. Oh, I'm here. I think I have enough blood packs for them. I do. Enough to make it worth our while. Oh, let's, let's have some fun. Let's uh, go to the shop. So what do you need? Hey, Carl. It's like Carl from Aqua Teen. Hey, yo, what do you need? Cool. That's a stim. I'm running low on stims. I might as well trade with him. Hmm. Hmm. Got bulk junk. I love it. How many stim packs? How many do I have? Yeah, I'm hurting. I only have uh, 457. Thank you. Need to sell that water. Wilder. Makes sense for the missiles to go first, right? Oh. Cool. No. Fine. Thanks. We're gonna keep gawking. We're gonna start cocking. Well, well, look who's back. Where's our boy? Well, he's sleeping. What time is it? All these guys should be in bed. Almost well, time for the sun to come up. The family nice. will. Always a pleasure to receive to receive you. Thank you. What's this? Wow. Just a dirty cheater now. Pure books, then we're good. Damaged and intact ones. Three 
360. Hello. Welcome back. Oh, you can I can give you the hollow tags? Talk to Scribe oh, Jameson. No. She's our keeper of the scrolls. She will want to know what you have found. Where can I find them? She spends most of her time in the archives. Cool. You'll find them in A Ring, near the Great Hall. Books. Heck. Oh. Very well. 1K, heck yeah. Keep moving, Wastelander. Okay, act coy, like you don't know me. Take your ammo while I'm here. <laughs> that robot's still freaking me out. Can I see the crater? Yeah, there's a there's a big crater there. Whoa. I'll deal with that later on. Looks like this was a missile si missile silo. The how the interior looks. Oh hi. Good. I think I remember seeing more red dots here. Yep. Yeah, that looks like a missile silo to me. Ooh. Neat. Place looks empty. And slightly glitchy. Okay, nothing else here. Ooh. It's my FOV90. Oh, hi. Yep. Another day in the talent company. When will they learn? Someone has left Vault 101 and wants their head. Hi. Am I TC yelling right now? What is this? No, I'm still here. So much environmental storytelling, wow. Where's the guy who's gonna come out of the corner and say, you're dead meat? Awesome. Lots of ammo. Mm. Nice. Turpentine kept clean. Oh. Oh. Okay, so I came from here. Okay, that loops around here. There's a downstairs and an upstairs. Let's go upstairs for a sec. Hello. And say hello. Should be scared. If he knew what I did to his friends. Let's have an ultimate laser rifle to sell off. No, we'll get more of them here. Oop. Neat. Make a moonshine with fusion batteries. Fission batteries. Oh, I forgot about those two lasers that I didn't... Or that's those two turrets I didn't destroy. Oops. 
Didn't mean to pick up the flamer. Those are pretty heavy for no reason. Don't think I have many crutches. Cool. Oh, we're scaven. I saw everything up there. Whoa, it goes deeper. Ooh, change of audio. Just those two. Three? Where are they going? The AI breaks with the suit on. Makes sense. What's in here? Building. Okay, it could be ING. Stealing. Fuck. Okay, it was stealing. Good. Okay. Free. Got two mugs, not bad. Camera too. Gotta get those ribs. And that camera too. Oh, cool. Poor guys. Should have trusted their hunch. So many. So many lost. Oop. Uh. You. Oh my god. Oh, hi. You look special. Oh, there's a... And there's the turret terminal over here. Over here. Nice. That doesn't fall with that. Fuck. Oh my god. Just like a real raccoon, no one sees squint on in. No one doesn't see him, see him squint, squint on in. Very cute. He do be squinting. I mean... Oh. I mean, I know it, the, the word is there. I just wanted to see if I can get replenished, but fine. Nice. I'm just so sneaky. Let's deactivate them for fun. No, let's activate them for fun. Keep them on for a sec. Let them feel like they're safe. Ooh. Meth lab? I saw a green dot. Oh, it's probably you. Oh, Commander ja Jabsko? Okay. Not like there's any lore with him. Eight missiles. That ammo perk was so has been so fun. I'm glad I didn't have it the whole time so I can appreciate how good it is now. Like the hot sauce? There's a hot sauce named that? Oh it's Tabasco. <laughs> nice. Just like the hot sauce. Oh, the flamer. It's gonna make the ultimate combat knife, but it's fine.
Oh. Cool. Would have never. Good thing I saw that. It's like right out of the corner of my eye. There's someone hiding it too. Chabasco. Oh. Oh, that actually didn't kill him. Surprise. Let me surprised. Oh. Oh. Don't think there's any diplomatic way to talk to him. So. Might as well have some fun. Yes. Rip. I think that hurt me too. Talent Company. I didn't even know they have combat armor. No, it didn't hurt me much. Where's that? I hear it clicking away. Where are you? Right here? You are. Really? Okay, well... I have fun to blow them up while crouching. You always get the crit damage each time, even though you're like, you know, making noise. Why are you down? What's going on? I feel like that guy would have activated him or something. Commander Jabsko. Let's look, up, look him up for a sec. Our Jabsko is the leader of the Talon Company. Whoa. And is the only member of the organization not to wear the Talon... the trademark armor. Oh. Yeah, here we go. Instead, he wears uh, metal armor and a Talon Company combat helmet, a unique piece of armor. And uses the uh, Ox Occam's Razor unique weapon in combat, close combat. The brands of Talon's company plan mercenary operations from safety of his bunker in Fort Bannister. Though he claims to be a combat veteran who's who's proved his ability in many times over, his subordinates have yet to see proof of his claims. In fact, he is called Jetting Jabsko behind his back, as he apparently tends to flee combat rather than face it. To face any but favorable odds. Other interactions. He's hostile, uh, he's a hostile non-player character who can only be fought, as his substantial amount of health, <laughs> well that didn't count here, uh, more than a death claw or companions, good armor, metal armor and talent company helmet, good thing I just put a frag on him, and his use of a missile launcher, Chinese pistol and Osman Occam's razor in combat, making him a, the boss character of Fort Bannister. Furthermore, Jabsko, just lucky me, I just put on, put the bomb in him. That was so good. Oh. Killing him this early, I actually prevented a certain special thing happening. But okay, furthermore, Jabsko is supported by two to three co town company mercenaries who spawn when the player enters the combat with him. They are scaled down to be extremely short, almost childlike in size, and the commander will immediately activate a Mr. Gutsy to assist him using a nearby terminal. Finally, he is protected by a pair of automatic turrets, which can be 
turned loose on the town company using the terminal just before yeah, his bunker. There we go, listen to this. Command killing Commander Jabsko before completing Take It Back, thus ending the main storyline, will prevent the occurrence of a special encounter in the Broken Steel update uh, add-on, in which Paladin Jensen and a squad of Brotherhood of Steel Paladins launch an attack on the town company forces around Fort Berenster. Neat. I even let's see if I picked up Occam's razor. I don't think I did. I didn't. What the hell? What the hell? Do I? Okay, let me look this up. What was spawned if I? Neat combat. Yeah, he just found it on his body, but I didn't get it from him. There's, a gu there's another one called Stab Happy, this other uh, knife that's even better. Looks like it. So, is that the one that the pint sized slasher has? Let's see. Oh no, it's found in the Bethesda ruins. Interesting. Anyway. Oh well, no special knife for me. A pirate's life for me. Yeah, I can just stay there. Not much lost, really. It's just a combat knife that has uh, slightly better stats. I'm gonna do it because I have a problem. Oh, hi! Poor guy. I was hoping he'd run to a gun on the floor to make this, like, a fair battle, but nope. Oh, ow. Maybe I don't have to get those two turrets that I want to shoot up so bad. Nope, just in a radioactive reactor. Nothing special here. Oh, my health- my O2 goes down really slowly now. Is that like an effect of endurance? I think it might be. I would theorize endurance probably increases your uh, oxygen levels. Oh, hi. Hi. I don't know why Talon Company has such pale faces. Seems like a glitch. But everyone in Talon Company that I've been facing lately has like really pale, a really pale face for some reason. Like, you don't know what's going on. I'm definitely not going back to do that. Cool. Oops. Almost died. Come on, just go back. Take me back. No, where is it? That ah, fine. I'll go this way. 
wanted to go in the other entrance, but it's fine. Look, there's this uh, door that said W. That said, uh, whatever. The entrance place. To the fort. I'll just go this way instead. I'm sure it'll connect. They were not expecting someone who can't distance <laughs> to can't activate mines now, were they? <laughs> Rip. I'll I'll do it, folks. I I'll. It's gonna compromise and say I'm not gonna take the armor because it really isn't that much. Uh, money. I didn't say I wasn't gonna take the uh the weapons. More of this folks, more sneaking. Look, it's never fun taking on these guys anyway, right? Isn't it more fun to see them just get killed in one hit? Come on, why isn't your code just weapons? There. Fuck it. Let's have some fun. Ugh. Goodbye. Shooting me here. Know that. Ha! Retreat! Fucking retreat! <laughs> Fucking retreat! It's like how I would jokingly say that. Safely looting everything while they. Let's turret F's things up. Mark 7, huh? It's a pretty good turret. Oh. He was green for a sec. Oh, ran into it. Yep. It's 10 pounds. See, I can get, like, money off of them by just getting the weight- more weightless stuff. Doesn't have to be all the weighted stuff, right? Unless I can repair it. Okay, this turret's had its fun. Oh, come on. Shish kebabin. On my nobbin. Vulgar. Just vulgar language. Oh. If you didn't learn once, you'll... Yep. Yeah, this is the place I was looking back for. Looking for back then. Cool. Nice and trample. Surprised I'm not over encumbered with those yet. Combat shotguns. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Oh. Aw, oh, the fire actually got him. Yoink. 
Nice cola. Coca Cola. These two are good. Oh god, I'm standing up. I feel so vulnerable. Now I'm safe. Coca Cola. Thank you, Riku. I always appreciate a Coca Cola in the chat. Oh, okay, you spawned in. You did not exist a second ago. Oh god. Dub. Close call. That's it. Hello? Wow. Fire, do your thing. There we go. Did it. These guys will burn up. Unlike a lot of the other guys. Oh boy. Doesn't look that different than regular combat armor. Oh. That's why. Nice. I was wearing two arm sets of combat armor at the same time. Wow, I'm at 20. 20 weight left. Door. Oh, hi. I guess I was here. <laughs> Looks like it for sure. Uh-huh. How? What? Oh, I guess I just went one way. There's two ways. Just loops around, huh? Huh. Yep, looks it. Okay, then what's that other place? It's one other exit or entrance. Over here. Rip. Still gets me. Aw. Thanks for the heart. It's a whole dang ass, different ass, location ass. Hi. <laughs> it's like a bigger than normal skeleton. <clears throat> Looks like it, at least. Oh boy, we're doing junk scavenging. Oh, that's a heavy battery. Doing myself a favor here. Nice little flavor. A lot of business, business has been done in here, I can tell. Oh, hi. Nice rifle. I might, might want to take that.
talent company, you're done. Your leader's dead. Time to go home. Pack it up. Pack it in. A ghost run while you can okay fine or just stand in the corner turn into a flamer i guess baseball cool scrap metal central I need these lead pipes to lay these pipes. We have like ribbon cutting and you know brick laying ceremonies. Where's the pipe layer? Pipe laying ceremony. Where's that, huh? Where's the... Why doesn't the town get together when someone starts laying a pipe? When they put in a cornerstone for a building? Okay, whatever. What about that pipe laying? Nice. Who's down there? Join the wrong group. Oh, Batman. Book of Science. Wow. I'm, like, tempted to COC right now. I think I will. Oh, it was down here. Cool. Time travel. Essentially. Hello? Hello? Who's there? Yeah, I'm sure. They'll find me. <laughs> Caution still. That's funny. Still in caution. Get no longer in caution. I've gotten addicted to it now. Now that I broke the seal in episode 20 or so, 21. It's now. We're now in the COC megaton player home days. Welcome. Looking for that special. It's my pleasure oh, to boy. offer hot death in a variety. Please, enjoy my selection of high-quality problem solvers. Thanks. Now it's time to really time travel. Nope, it's Benning. Ben Canning. 
Let's see. Let's do him a favor. South's been low this whole time. Did I do it in the save? No, I didn't. Uh, I think it's just reset health. Yep, self is reset. I gave him water a while ago, so that that should have kicked into effect by now. After years of gameplay, bro, let's do him a favor. No, 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 no. There. Looking for that special. I'm just using my man, hundred and here are medical means to remake yourself. Oh my gosh, the amount of money you get for one of the laser rifles is wild. Thanks. Oh, wait. Here to acquire a new I think recon armor can repair if clothes it. Make the man, then here are the means to remake yourself. Thanks. Let's do some of this. Just want to have that fully repaired. Just have a nice pair of that. Uh, if you had Searching another combat helmet, enough. I would buy it. If the clothes make the man, then here are the means to remake yourself. Oh. Wow. Thanks. Nah. I want my wolf gang. Give me my wolf gang. Where my wolf gang at? Welcome to Megaton. Doc Hop? Here to see the good doctor? Tell me what you need, and maybe I've got your fix. I want sugar bombs and Nuka Cola. You don't got none. Unless you got buns, hon. Fuck it. Just give me all the good chems. Oops. Cool. Drugs, very cool. So tempted to sell it, but I'm sure it, it's more beneficial to actually use it. Pretty sure. You get extra points over 100. Hmm. 17 scrap metal? Damn, I was collecting. Pleasure doing business with you. Fine, no Wolfgang. So I can just drop these off right here. I wish there oh, were more people like you in the world. I want you to have this. People that can hover? Me too. Walter. What do you need? Please. Um, huh? yeah. That's what I get for TCLing. It's kind of really not worth doing that anymore, I guess. Scrap metal trading. 
My god, so many stims. Cool. Moira. Sell some of my junk to you. Hi. Huh. Sure thing. Cool, got 10k. It's another perk. Feverish for another perk. Okay, I think I'm done. Good. I think I'm done with this. Almost back to adventuring after we're done item managing here. Why not keep your gun out? Cool. Cool. Yeah, putting away the one quantum. This gameplay is a really good look into my psyche, I feel. Just the stuff that I choose to prioritize, and how much of my gameplay has been filled with just, like, item managing over these past 20 or so episodes. Um, cool. There was, like, one more guy left in there that I didn't kill. One day I'll get to the crater, and then we'll move on with the story. Hit up a little lamplight. Oh. Ow. Where are my guys at? I don't even know what was shooting at me. Oh, hi. Rip. Ow, my eyes. Ooh. Neato. Bats to try to find where this red dot is. Guess he's up here. I don't think I went up here. That far up here. Oh. Okay, this is familiar. Yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah, then there was the guy saying, who's there? Alright. Don't know where this enemy is. Probably just a turret somewhere. Sounds like it. I think I see it. Yeah. No? No. Whatever. Hit me. There you are. Heh. It's working. 
guess. <laughs> Fire killed it. Alright, well, okay. That was most of this place, I think. Time for the crater. Crater. Creator. Like the violins in this song. I think that's all the song is. Oh. Mine. Mine. Also mine. Wow. Oh. Seize ammo chest crate. Ooh. Oh. Can't make it. Oh. Whoa. Well, Good. that's the end of that. Good job. I guess. Oh, poor guy. Okay, well, some decisions were made here, I guess. Mine. That was quite the random event. You'll stay out of this if you know what's good for you. We found that um, water, and we just took it all. It. No point in any more killing over this water. Let's just split it and walk away. I'm fine with that. I guess I'll take being robbed over being killed. Eh. But I don't have to like it. Take your water and get the hell. Take five of them if you want. You've got what you came for. Why don't you move on? I'm not looking for any new friends at the moment. Yep, here's the big crater. Looks like talent companies here. Oh no, that's Enclave. Oh great. Now they're a thing. Wow. There's a lot of Enclave here. Holy moly. Sure. Okay, well. That's what happens when you stop caring, I guess. Oh, okay, there's only one entry left, I think. Yep. Are we too safe? <laughs> oh, yeah, I can keep trying that over and over. Okay, anyway. Hurriedly. Nice. Good password. I would have never guessed hurriedly. Build op- Oh, well, <laughs> flag. Cool. Build operations enclave. God bless America. Read first. Welcome to- Um. Okay. Uh, welcome- you have been chosen by our great president to explore and collect samples at the crater location at sector 276Z. Provide the provided armaments situ stationed with you have proven reliable during early testing. However, should any problem arise, you are recommended to power down the defense grid using this terminal. Thank you for your participation. Press main base connection. Function disabled. Message zero. Powered down defense grid. Cool. Whoa. Nice. Good loot. Hello. Hello. Oh, hell yeah. I see the alien cells down there. Save here for a sec. What do we have here? Some rocks? Okay. Let's do some double damage with this sneak attack. Dead.
Wow. <laughs> Whoa, uppercut. Woof. Poor guy. Ooh, a plasma pistol. I don't think I've had one of those yet. Bye. Hurt me more than I hurt it. More than I hurt it. Hi again. Yeah, I didn't I don't think I needed the vats for them. Nice unique armor. Nope. Got one zesty guy down here. No, the iBot seems alright. Oh. Enclave scientist. Nice. Not expect them to have like a unique set of armor. Hello, alien cells. Eight. Nice. Seventy-six of them. That should be. Okay. Oh, and a safe. I'm pretty sure that music's fine to play, but. Not trying to stay here too long. Cool. Oh. Nice. Cool. I think that's all the things here. Let's save for a sec. Well, I double check the wiki. The wikia. Mm-hmm. Red scorpions thrive here. Oh, there's a personal locker, foot locker south of the truck. Interesting. After the waters of life, the Enclave Detachment will establish a post here. Turret officer, scientist. Including one Enclave soldier carrying a fat man and a mini nuke. Really? I doubt that. Oh, yep. Game broke. I don't know about that. Pretty sure I looked through their inventory and there wasn't. Okay, there's actually just two more main places I want to go to and then we're done with all the tabs. That's so wild. Think about tabs I've been talking about for the last 12 episodes. I know where one of them is, like, really well. There it is. Nope. I don't need this personal locker. Can live without it. It's right there. Just curious where it was. That said that. Cool. There was so not. There was so no guy with a uh, fat man here. Come on. Don't lie to me like that, Wiki. I'm max level and there's no fat man guy. Really. Oh, I think I missed that chest that's on top there. Cool. There's always so many more things you can find in this game up here. Nice. Did not have a fat man. Guess what? No fat man. Okay. It was a nice little diversion, though. I want to go to the Deathclaw Sanctuary. So I will in a minute. But first, let's, uh... Let's do one of the places I've been meaning to do for a while. I finally found out how to do. I think it's here. Yes, it is. Okay, so... This is the... Supposedly the White House is right here. All these pillars that were exploded. And this crater that's here. Supposedly that was the White House. And the way you get in... If I discover the White House Plaza... Is this little manhole here. 
You actually do come here later for a different mission. For a broken steel mission, I think. But I was like so baffled, like how do you get through for the longest time? Because if you go like, there, there's like a fence there that's like impenetrable. You cannot get behind it. And apparently there's just a manhole. That's of course there is a manhole there. Why wouldn't anyone think that? Well, it's because you don't often have to look for them. It's usually like an optional thing. Lots of nice uh, construction materials here. Crafting recipe stuff. I actually don't think there's any hostiles here. There might be, but I'm pretty sure there isn't. Whoa. That's that Gambrio Havoc physics coming into play. Feels like it's gonna go to a dead end. Dead end. Vodka. Paint gun. Oh. Oh, hi. Yep, we discovered the White House. The last staffers. Look, a fat man. With so many other fat men. Nice. The fat men are thriving. Nature is healing. Cool. Great fascist armor. Don't love that. It's the Enclave, it's American armor. Got the nice 10 pack of water from that interaction. Feels really earned. I think that's all there is here. Just these two guys and the, uh, you know, the, the casual three mini nukes and a fat man. But yeah, got that location discovered. Nice. Yep, and then that's the location, I think, to get to continue forward in uh, part of Broken Steel. There's one other thing here. Dun, dun, dun. There's this silly little... Uh, piece of environmental storytelling where there's this these two ramps over this car and there's like a motorcycle that that uh fell over it's environmental storytelling saying like someone came down here with a motorcycle tried ramping up but got stuck on the uh the light there so his head's just clipping up there Yeah, I don't think there's anything actually here. Ooh. Noise. N-O-N-O-I-C-E. -O -N -O -E. Noise. Yep, that's it, I think. I don't think there's anything on this side in this tunnel either. That was one of the places. Okay. Okay, I actually have just three tabs open. One of them is just the tabs for the perks, so I can access that pretty quickly, but I could just do that on my phone. So the two last tabs are Gallows Humor, which is a quest from, uh, given by Lion's Pride. 
So I guess someone in Lion's Pride. Uh, it's... Let's see. So it's in the Citadel. Citadel A-Ring. It's, uh, talk to some members of Lion's Pride in the Great Hall after gaining access to the Citadel. They will tell you, tell a lone wanderer that they're about a betting pool trying to guess Gallo's real name. So, that's a little unmarked quest. And it, apparently you can get a thousand caps from it. It's pretty, da pretty dank. The other place is, uh, Shale Bridge, which is a anthill. Abandoned car fort. I'm just reading up on the Wikipedia for Shade Dale. Shale, Shale Bridge. I keep not saying its name. Okay. Vault 87. Okay, yep, so it's in this general area. There's a lot of stuff I haven't discovered around here. Wow. There's a rest stop that's here. It's time to take, like, explore this area and have the main place I want to go to is Shale, Shale Bridge. Yeah. Oh my god. Well. It's happening. Fire! Dead. Uh oh. Oh my gosh. It's a bad idea. Come in here. Here we go. Oh. Yeah. too broken up about not getting all the gear here. Like, you know, I've... it's the Enclave. Who cares? Goodbye. Oh god, why have I done this to myself? cursed myself with damnation of having a uh, weight in this game. Ten missiles. It's like a thousand caps right there. Okay, well, I guess I'll come back here later in a sec. Might as well unload everything again. Fallout style. This guy go. It just evaporated. Oh, hi. Sugar bombs, fun. Do not remember attacking them. Oh, hi. Oh, great. 
They're still around. Goodness. Okay, thanks for helping. Baited. Wow, it's three AM. Um daylight savings just happened? What just been having that much fun. Damn. It's not daylight savings, is it? Do we leap forward? I mean, it is Sunday into Saturday or whatever. Or Saturday into Sunday. That's why you said time travel. That makes sense now. You said time travel, but can I notice the time change? It was, uh, 154 when you said the heart. And it was 3.01 when you said the time travel. It skipped an hour forward. Wow. Well, good morning, everyone. Everyone go to your favorite place and get the breakfast meal an hour earlier today. Like the uh, Taco Bell breakfast. Okay, well. Uh, we're, go we're, we're fucking. We're fucking. Going to Rivet City. You know what? Hey. I'll never forget you. You saved my life. There. Been a minute. You know, while he's drinking some, we should too. There's a lot of merchants and merchants in here that I can sell shit to. So we will. Oh, or I guess not yet. Yes. Welcome to Potomac Attire. Welcome to Potomac Attire. Stems. Lucas stems. Uh. Good. Pleasure doing business with you. Your order. Water and a Meyer look kit, please. Well, I need to be an hour to take out this gun. There he is. Decided to check out the holler. Holler at you. Fat man. Tempted to take it so I can repair the other one. Just have a, another full fat man for fun. Uh, good wares. Don't need most of them. Whoa. Whoa, 50 caps per. Oh my god. I feel like I'm over encumbered. Cool. Thanks. Don't even think of breaking into that. Okay, geez. Woof. If I take a psycho or whatever. 
20% increase. Yao Guai too. Um, I can even do the Vault 101 quest if I wanted to. It's an option now. I'm collecting a lot of fat men, so I might as well just have a second super one. Nice. They're fun to have. I want to repair this too. So I didn't sell it before. The uh, plasma rifle that I was holding on to. Anything else I want to mess with? Oh, I don't even have to repair that. Hmm. Oh, so low. I think I'll sell it for now. Oh, cool. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, I can't repair that with this? With a... Oh, assault rifle. There, that's what I meant to take. Also, I really don't need that on hand if I have the other assault rifle. So I think I will sell that. Because I have this one. I don't really need a repa fully repaired one of those around. Oh yeah, I almost forgot about this junk. Any junk in here I want to get rid of? Um, cool. I wonder what the best radiation resistance armor is. Probably it's a uh, heavy, uh, it's probably power armor. Maybe. Fuck it. No, I'm gonna put one away and repair my Chinese stealth with it. I'm just gonna repair both of them with each other, but. The recon armors. I'll just fully up that. Cool. Oh, finally used for this, right? Cool. Hmm. I that's all armor I can use for repairs. Oh, I need even more. Oh. Cool. Sell, sell, buy, sell. Been getting blood packs from those uh, enclave things. Yay. Love all my wonder meat. Catch me saying that phrase. Scrap. Tempted to hold on to these now that I... Yeah. Okay, I know I want to go to that Shade Dale place. Whatever I keep shale dale shale bridge. You, thank you for Thank you. Oh. It reminds me. I think this is ready. 
happen. Good morning, sir. Fast. What? Time traveling a lot. Yep. If yep. Here, see how much purified I have. Five. Good. Oh, I never sold all these, did I? No, I didn't. Okay. That's something that's been weighing me down. Sugar bomb. Ultra jet. Yeah. Nice. What'll it be? I'm selling all my stealth boys here. Oops. Or not, damn. Did not know they sold for so much. Makes sense. Enjoy. Hello. You'd best have cancer. Wow. There's so much to spare still. Done. It's pretty good. Oh, I didn't still sell any of the stealth boys actually. Fuck, forgot about that. So many still. Um. Fuck it. I wanted to go back to Mega or uh, Rivet City. I'll go to the chem cellar. See if that can offer me anything. This is the ideal fallout man. Yes. 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 Welcome to a quick fix. There. It's better. Nice to see you again. Nice. Sure. Ninety nine, whoa. Cool. Thanks. Tanks. I know I'm still holding on to a ton of those. Oh god. Anyway. Lesson learned. Let's just explore a little bit this way. thing on my map. Eh. Eh. I don't know if we're gonna do uh, daylight savings anymore. I think this might have been the last year of that. If I recall hearing that correctly. So that'll be interesting. Neat little where were you when the last 
um, daylight savings happen situation. Where was I? I was here with you, the viewer. That's that's right. It's you, the viewer. Oh god. Potato. Oh hi, Overlord. That's twelve shots. It's not landing a single hit. Wow. Poor guy. Whoa. Only if you could use the mini nuke. Maybe that would have helped. Oh, more friends. Probably raiders. Yep. Rip. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I had to end like this. You seemed like chill people. Whoa. It's a casual mini nukes here. Huh. Whatever. Bucket? Oh. It's like Disco Elysium. The Hanged Man. Oh. Heard an explosion. That's what got that uh, out of me. Um. Eh. Eh. No. Yes. Okay, there's no point. Surveying. Hmm. Nice truck over there. Did I discover something here? I did. Um. Five axle rest up. Okay, I'll check out the truck. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Death claws? Probably, yeah. Let's tend to have loot in them. Oh. There's a lot of places around me I haven't discovered. Hmm. Oh. Something's below me, I think. Meyer Lurk. Thing about checking out the Death Claw Sanctuary because I think there's a like the Endurance Bobblehead or something in there. There's also an abandoned car fort thing. Ooh. Chilling out. See, he was a lot chiller than the other guys that were hanging out in the truck. I enjoy the crickets. Crickets are one of my favorite white noise. 
Rain is a good one, too. Yeah, I've been here before. I think. Feels familiar. Oh, hi. Abandoned car fort. It is abandoned. Junkyard. Oh, my God. I always feel like I'm missing out when I hear those distant explosions, but then I realize half the time it's probably just one of those guys. Those zappy robots. Sounds like he's just down there shooting at some- oh! It's right here. Oh, it's a Deathclaw. No, it's a Mirelurk. Critical strike. Rip. Ow. Oh, okay. Come here. Give me your meat. Aw, crickets. Singing me a song. What, their legs? Oh. Took some cams. Whoa, that claw's wigging out. Nice. Oh. Another? Yep. Let's do some bats for fun. Why is it 26%? My AP looks like it's... Never used VATS, but my AP was refilling pretty fast. I'm glad to see that that perk is coming in a little handy. Oh! That's a good sign. Because we're looking for an ant hill. Yep. Can I just, uh... Can. There. Where's that hill? Hey. No scope. Oh, I see some mushrooms. Seems like the place could be. Have I been here? Oh, there it is. It was here. Nice. Come on. Yeah. I don't think I've been here. Ooh. Feels like something should be here. Oh, it was it isn't one of the ones I can activate. Lame. It's fine. It happens. Most of the best of us. The one that's over here though, I'm pretty sure. It's surrounded by super mutants. So I'm not interested that much really. In that one. Dumb. Oh man, this is low on condition. Yep. It's pretty close to like 10, probably two more clips. Okay, I'll be right back. I really got a waz. So, BRB. Oh.
Hello. I'm gonna hope you didn't hear all that horrendous stuff going on in the other room. Well, I know it's time to refill. Good, we got- we're good on weight. Oh. Although I, there is a lot of this I can get rid of still. But it'll be fine. I think we'll- we're light enough for this. Kind of tempted to just, uh, go through here and clear it all out with my shish kebab. Make it easy on myself. Never done that before. Oh. Green. Oh, they're so small. Cute. Little guys. You can forage your ants. Aw. How sweet. Oh, we still got to see the first bad boy. Oh, they're protecting the eggs. Oh, administer some low grade stimulant could benefit the growth of the colony's pupa. <laughs> Interesting. Oh no! Wait, let's- okay, let's do it. No! Invader ant! <laughs> Appears that these ants are from another ant colony. Perhaps attacking a rival one could help the forager ant survive. Cool. I'll do it for them. Interesting. I know that I can help change the tides of this ant battle. Appears they've been using a comp... Ants appear to be using this compost heap to med... metabolize a food supply. Oh, they're making mushrooms. Ant secretions combined with the compost appears to be forming a potent chemical compound. Ooh. Nice. Hope the forager ants are alright. It's so funny, I'm playing like Ant Hill over here. Playing, uh, was it Ant Farm? Cool. Hmm. Not crouched right now. Yeah, they're all friendly. I can inject a stim pack in there to help them out. It's supposed to be like a scientist or something in here. Scientist's body. It's supposed to have a weird like glitch where a book will respawn on them every day, every three days. That's in here. So much nectar. Yum.
Hi. Feels like I'm missing something. Sus. Very sus. Hmm. He'll look on the wiki in a sec. Curious to learn more about this interesting place. Oh, this sounds like there's one stuck in the ground. Hmm. Okay, let's save and then look at the wiki for a sec. Fort, got it. I think I got all the stuff there. The car next uh, the fort next to the Oh. So there's actually a book that's at the car fort that I missed, but anyway, Shade Dale. There are two separate tunnel systems here. The Shade Dale Tunnel, marked by a green mushrooms, passive ant colony, and the Shade Dale Hill, aggressive ant colony, surrounded by golden mushrooms, fungus. Uh, ant clutches, copy of DC Journal. Okay. Oh, here. So the ant compost heap will continue to visually display it being empty. However, it can still have ant nectar residing inside if the large ant egg pile has been injected with stim packs and an appropriate number of days have passed. Cool. Okay. Oh, I see the golden mushroom piles on the Wikipedia. And it says so this pat so located south of the car fort, past the wrecked trains and the irradiated zone between some ant clutches next to a corpse of a raider. It's possible that the corpse may not be president president. <laughs> oh, I see it now. Cool. Nope, glitched. Glooched. Oh, I think I found the, the dead body. Oh, I did TCL, oops. My F on V90. Ant researcher, big book of science, here he is. This is the guy that I was talking about where every like three days apparently he uh, respawns. The big book of science. I don't need it, it's just uh just like I want to see for myself. Not that I need it or anything. Excuse me. I don't want to come off desperate. Docile.
Don't want to try finding this ant pile. It's right around here. Okay, this is the this is the place of the enemy ant hill. Goodbye. It's supposed to be a pile of eggs close to here, where there's a raider and a book. It's closer this way. South of the place, though. Let's see if they're right. Don't see no eggs. Oh, ant. Hi. Oh, I think it's over here. Yeah, this looks it. I think I see it. Yep. Nice. Oh, the raider didn't spawn. Found the book, though. On the Wikipedia, there's a raider that spawns here. Oh, Stealth Boy. Cool. Need more of those. Red Scorpion. Oh, hi. Hello. Okay, well, I guess the raider that was here turned into a rad scorpion, even though there's supposed to be a dead raider. But yeah, good thing we found it. Peels completed. Oh man. Spend the scorpion. Got to them. That darn, that devil, no, that dragon scorpion. I was thinking of that video game title, that dragon cancer. Sweet. We're gonna clear this place out and then we'll call it a call it another tab closed. Which we love to see. Then I'll do the Death Claw Sanctuary, and then we'll see where we are. Ooh, people were here. Just the one ant researcher. I think there's a, a queen ant in here. One of the big ones. I mean, of course, queen ants are always big, but I mean, a lot of the mutant big ones get real big. I always think those are going to be, like, refuge piles. Straggly stuff. Uh. Ah. Ooh. The metal armor just melted off of him with age, I guess. That's what happens with armor and skeletons, just melts. You just melt through the armor, right? That's what happens, I think. Oh, hi. Poor guy. Lost to history. Whoa. There she is. Um, let me just fix something. Apparently there's an enclave outpost near the abandoned car fort. Not interested. Hidden tunnels. reading some stuff on the 
map on the uh, wiki. Not much here except ant workers, ant soldiers, and a giant queen. Metal armor. Yep. Some ammo in that queen's lair. Ant queen pheromones, eh? Oh, it's Schmate. Hello, Schmate. <laughs> Wait, what are you referring to? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's right. Or what was that about? I'm curious. Yay, hello. Nice to see you. Good morning. I don't know if this happened for you, and I was curious about this actually. But it was daylight savings today, in the U.S. at least. So, we uh, jumped an hour forward. That means I get to have Taco Bell breakfast that much sooner. Oh yeah, the skeleton melting part. Okay, good. That's what you're referring to? <laughs> how it melts, how we just melt over time, right? It's not the, the proper term. No, three weeks till you do that. So you're an hour closer to me. Aww. Very sweet. You just missed it, but there's this, uh, so there's these giant ants that I'm beating up. And, uh, there's like an ant hill that's really close by to this one that has all these, like, little baby ants. And I had the option to save them, which I did. So, these invader ants aren't, aren't gonna be bothering with them, bothering them anymore. They're the smallest ants I've ever seen in a Fallout game. Which is still pretty big in a Fallout game, or for real life standards. Yeah, that you're <laughs> I can forgive you for killing the big ants, not the babies. I'm just trying to save them from this other pesky colony. I'm not David Attenborough over here. I, I'm allowed to, you know, affect the outcome in nature. Not like a documentarian here. I get to choose who the victor is. Ooh, nice guns. Oh, uh, this... I think this skeleton, like, got crushed by this Brahmin. Oh, Rip. This bowed lady was too much for him. Bodacious. Oh, no. <laughs> they actually expected me to tra to platform that, huh? Okay. That looks right. That boy ain't right. Wow. This does not look like I'm supposed to be here, but the enemy placement is telling me otherwise. Goodbye. Oh, skeletons. love the Bethesda things are set up where if you grab an item it'll make all the rest of them pop up for some reason it's for some reason all the, the the placement is like linked together and if you pull one apart it's like a domino effect don't know why don't know why that happens Don't know why they don't just like individually glue them each down. Oh, an exit. Nice. Oh, that's the other direction I could have gone, I guess. Yeah. Who's there? Oh, there's three directions, I think. Yeah.
The objects are each their own type of ant. <laughs> ant communication. Ant to ant communication. Poor ants. I'm pretty sure they have the ability to smell me. Know that I'm there, but... I guess they depend on visual aids, too. To see me. I'm sure that's a proven thing, that ants probably don't even need their sight, they just go off a of smell. <laughs> they need not your smells. They just want their queen's stink. That's all they need. They know mine compared to the queen. I think I got everyone except the queen now. Ooh. Nice. You can, you can keep that. I don't really need those. You can keep your melted off armor. Down, down to Goblin Town. Oh. Oh, hi. Okay. You exist now. <laughs> Got all your cue balls going off inside you. Okay, I... I entered a chamber and I saw the queen, but... But... It's hard to miss a, an, a queen ant's butt, to be fair. But... It's gonna take me a minute to find them again. Oh, I think this is the chamber. Sounds like it. Oh boy. There she is. And I'm hidden. Nice. Oh, I'm so curious to see how much damage I can do on a sneak attack to, to the ant. <laughs> ant queen spotted. She's hard at work doing her thing. It's pretty cute in Pikmin. Those ball bore creatures, those two-legged creatures that have like the ladybug backs. They have a, a queen too that looks like this. That has the big, uh, big back thing that makes eggs. I think it's fun. That creature creation, that creature design. And its main attack is like rolling over to squish your Pikmin. Skellingtons. What secrets do they hold? Different types of ants, I see. Okay, now how do I reverse pickpocket my phone number into her pocket? Is that too forward? Hmm. <laughs> Unique idle animation you usually don't see unless you're, you know, as hidden as I am. Okay, well, sorry this had to happen, but I want to save those that other ant colony. And to do that, I have to do something here. Um. <laughs> look away! No. Um. God, save the ant queen. <laughs> I'm sure that's something you'll be saying a lot nowadays. Okay. Check this out. Only mark, yeah, respect, true. Zap. Rip. Made quick work of her. Got her pheromones. I'm out of here. I think she respawns over time, so. 
At least we can rest assured she'll be back. Just like Frosty the Snowman. She'll be back again someday. Okay, wow. Good. <laughs> I want to go back to the little ants just to show you how tiny they are compared to these big ones. But after that, I'm... I think I'm done with this location. Except I'm on the wiki and there's this section that says hidden tunnels and I'm kind of curious. Is there any reason? On the local map, there are what appear to be openings to tunnels that are not found when reaching that point on the map. Two of these make a complete small loop and another appear to be, appears to be a long tunnel along the outside of the cave to the left. Climbing up on a boulder to the left of the two pillars and large room <laughs> near a small puddle is possible to walk up the boulders. No. There's no reason to go there. Okay. It does look like that. On I know what they're talking about. The other ant tunnel, I think. Uh. Okay. Ants, ants, ants. Oh my god, what is it? Saint, please remind me. The... I wear speedos. What is, is that Ants Canada? <laughs> Your favorite ant tuber? <laughs> god. Yes. <laughs> wow. Mikey Bustos. That's awesome. <laughs> it's, I can't believe that's real. And it, I can't believe that's real and that he he proudly has it up on his channel still or whatever whatever channel that's on. <laughs> Do you think he just forgot? You can't forget that. Make me Bustos. <laughs> Fuckboy sticker, hell yes. God. <laughs> I love the fuckboy sticker. Me and a friend of mine used to always be into fuckboy jokes, and it's probably because we both were tumblers, t tumbler kids, so... Look at how tiny! He's so puny compared to the other ones. And they're, they're all docile, they're all friends. They all just want to clean me. <laughs> no way, he moved back to the Philippines for his music career, hell yes! <laughs> and Canada, but he lives in the Philippines. Wow. Baby. Dirty styrofoam, clean ants. That's right. Sty styrofoam. God, the legend of styrofoam. Styrofoam. That's... <laughs> Wow, it feels like ages ago, even though it was like a month at this point. Okay, sweet. That was one of the last places I wanted to check out before I'm like... I feel like free to do whatever I want in this game. I had this list of- this- this like tab. The, the tab. Th this group of tabs that I've had open forever. Of like just unmarked locations that I want to make sure I check out, and I did, so... There's a lot of these places I haven't gone and visited yet, and I will over time. But, just good to feel that a few of them are checked off. Oh. Let's, uh, try this again. Yeah, well, in terms of the internet, that's forever ago. It's true. I'm gonna be hidden. Oh, yeah. Feels good to be done with a task. Hi. Oh my god. Wow, it's like a neat behavior I've never noticed. They're like attacking each other. Oh, hi. Fall back. <laughs> so part of the... So in the lore of this game, this enemy faction called the Enclave is now throughout the wasteland. But before, these guys wouldn't spawn. It's good to see them spawning and doing, uh, being ineffective. 
but I got this observ this observer's perspective. Goodbye. <laughs> Didn't have to worry about. I'm at max level, so it doesn't matter if I don't get the XP now. I just get to sit back and relax and watch the action. Just take the spoils of war afterward. Noise. Oh, hi. Ripped. <laughs> Yeah, the Enclave, it's this this group that's supposed to be like the last remnants of America, but really it's this, uh, I guess I don't want to really spoil it, but let's just say they, they have bad intentions. They, they want to like ensure the wasteland is a wasteland. Their end goal is to like... <laughs> just make the world a place where it could be reset again. One of those type of places. Accelerationists ideas and all that. There's a lot of kabooms happening out in the distance, but it's probably nothing important. Feels good to be a gangster. <laughs> This, like, cheating armor is so good. It makes me so happy. I can just get this neat perspective on fall I've never had before. It, it's also, I mean, it's it's just like the Skyrim experience of being a, a, a stealth 100 um, archer. Without the archery. It's more just stealth 100 uh, dagger. Hi. Fireworks, New Year's, yay! That's what the booms are. Actually, let's see what it is. Oh, it's getting close. It's November 22nd right now in my current play. I think there are a couple dates that actually affect the game, but not for the most part, there's none that really affect the game. Like, I think on some dates, they might be like, they might just like have different dialogue making allusions to the New Year's or whatever. Oh! Getting close to the new year. Okay, so. Oh my gosh, V turns up on the 5th of November. You just missed him, no! That's another day worth fireworks. Uh-huh. Okay, let's uh... Put the... Stealth kit back up. There should be a bobblehead somewhere in this location. That'll increase our stats. Hi. Friendly death claws. This game is really goofy. For some reason, anytime you use vats with a melee weapon, it doubles the attack. So, makes the, the crit damage from stealth even more. Okay. Taken care of. Don't know how many people are actually here. How many death claws? I'm feeling it's not many. Oh, I had psycho too, so that increased my damage. Oh. This seems like a special place. Any place where you and me are, audience, is a special place. rare when people are holding that many. Oh, merchant. Nice. Ooh, gnome. Aw. <laughs> Call it three. Cat. I'm glad I can cultivate this parasocial relationship with you, audience. <laughs> That's what every streamer likes to hear. Oh god, um, well, okay, I went unstealth right now. Ow. Oh, gr great, it's it's just like deleting my armor, right? Yeah. Oh, 
<laughs> Especially with an audience members. With audience members who know your full name and address. <laughs> lighthearted. Thank you for explaining lighthearted the other day. <laughs> In a uh, Discord. Is slash s serious or sarcasm? I assume it's sarcasm and if people really are going to use a slash s like for serious, they'll use slash srs. Oh, right, I'm not invisible. Fuck. You know, this seems quicker, actually. Let's let's stick to this instead of the uh, instead of the stealth build we like so much. So many piles of sinew. Definitely is a Deathclaw Sanctuary. It's been an invaluable tool for to me. Aw. S is sarcasm and SRS is serious. Yes, okay, cool. For some reason my instinct is when I see slash S is slash sarcastic. So that's good. That's what we want. So, cool. Come on, where's that bobble? In this universe, I'm just looking for to get some bobbin. As in bobbleheads, of course. What the fuck? Just going in the same circle over and over. Uh huh. Maybe we'll, we should go down to Goblin Town. It's always a good option. Ho ho, my lad. Oh. Ow. Claws really aren't the worst thing in this game for me. They are pretty, uh. pretty absorbent when it comes to laser blasts, it looks like. These piles of people are so goofy. It's like, oh, all this red meat chunks and then two people intact. Goodbye. That's pretty cool looking. Oh, yes, down, down, down. Party Wurmple. Between a few discords I'm in, we love to use the party, a party Wurmple emote that I love to. Just this wormhole that has a party hat on and he's giffing back back and forth, like flipping along the horizontal axis, I think. Um I always get those confused, especially when I'm like editing thumbnails, which axis is which. Like I always think one is this way, but it's actually not the one that I'm thinking. I always mess up horizontal and vertical. Like I know what they are, like horizontal obviously is the one that's like, you know, close like the horizon, but I, um, for some reason in, like, image editing software, it's not what I expect. Like, if they said rotate along the x-axis, I'd be like, okay, I get that. That I'd call that, I would call that vertical rotation or whatever, or mirroring. Horizontal, <laughs> vert, what cool. <laughs> why cool. Cute. Oh. This person has some good armor that I used to use back in the day. And I wasn't level 100 bartering. Oh, hi, Enclave. Officer, you're new. Jack! That's a unique item. Guess what? Jack is a ripper. This item is usually called a ripper. And then there's this version that's called that's just called Jack, of course, because this game is so clever. Back when I was a scrub. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Lamau. The English audience is going to love that one. The English. 
That item doesn't usually spawn until I've activated the, the quest line that makes the Enclave guy spawn. So I got here at a good time. I'd already discovered this location, but I didn't like explore it until now. You had to think about it. Hog. So many death claw hands. Or I suppose death claw claws, if you will. If you will. Red. This place seems special. Oh, vengeance. That's a unique, uh... Laser rifle thing. Gatling rifle. So many landmines on these guys. Cool. Oh. Okay, this is all neat and all, but I'm pretty sure there's a bobblehead somewhere around here. Still haven't found it. Don't want to freak out or anything, but... Ah! Pretty sure it's near like a pillar. Stalactite pillar or something. I'm gonna look it up real quick. <laughs> Give him the bob bobbing head. In this chat, we love to bob. The Fallout, the, the Fallout wiki has 44,844, oh, it's a palindrome, uh, pages right now. That is so many Wikipedia pages for, like, a fan wiki. Let that sink in, 44,844. With all the items that are, like, in Fall Guys, I think there's, like, still less than five, 5k pages on their, on their wiki. This one has close to 50 million, 50 million, <laughs> 50,000 entries. It seems like baffling to me. Directly south of the end. Oh. The endurance bubble head. Directly south of the entry inside of the cave. In the first chamber. On a short pedestal. Near a pile of corpses and a rotting Brahmin corpse. Oh no. Is immediately left to the bottom of a slope. Okay, whatever. Nicole Quantum. A few steps near the bobblehead. Vengeance and Jack. Yep. Body of the mercenary near the entrance may not be present if the player had previously passed through the and uh, area cell. Interesting. There are few spots of higher ground that can be used to safely clear the entrance area of death claws. Oh. Oh yeah. Okay, I know what they're talking about. You're outside. That's what they mean. Okay. Oop. Game crashed. Love to save. Just for Fallout 3 2 or all Fallouts? Uh, what is? I forget. The streamer has forgotten. Oh, the wiki. Yeah, it's for all Fallouts. Oh, hi. <laughs> yeah, it's for all Fallout games, not just the one game. Just then the Wikipedia went in the top... Uh, the top right corner, it says uh, just how many entries the wiki has. Well, that's referring to all, like, five Fallout games, so I guess that makes more sense. With the... With... Oh, hi, I'm just gonna cheat for a sec. Um, with Fall Guys, I guess it's just one game, so it's a little understandable why it's comparatively fewer. Um, let's see here. Wow, I have to go all the way back. It's quite the trek.
Wow. Nature's beautiful, isn't it? I love this gray... All the gray caves and these Fallout games. Ooh. Comparatively, the Disco Elysium only has 682 pages. Yeah, the... I feel like the disc... Oh, hey. This is the place I was looking for, I think. Possibly. Did mention something about a, a ramen body here. So a small pedestal. I don't think it's here, actually. It's probably a different place. It's all these different piles. Disco Elysium has a surprisingly very small amount of entries for what the game, how much, like, information there is in that game. These fan wikis, a lot of them end up being, like, you know, very low count of pages. And a lot of them are super under... Under, uh... I was, I was gonna say underfunded. I mean, they're completely underfunded, considering they're usually just volunteer work, I guess. Um, okay. I really want to play Disco Elysium again. I'm glad you got inspired by the, uh, the thing I sent you on Twitter to possibly do that with your little canvases. The artwork in Disco is so good. And those, like, personalities are so fun that they... I feel like they warrant getting their own little portraits. Oh yeah, you're trying to find another series that has more, I see. Find another game series with more entries, and the only one you were able to find was the Elder Scrolls with 71,907. 907. I wanted to say oh. <laughs> we were talking about that the other day. About the use of O as zero. Nice. That was a good sign. Oh, here it is. I was going to say, yeah, there's a Nuka-Cola Quantum there, which the wiki said was close to it. But yeah. Got the bobblehead. Description at the base reads, always be ready to take one more, <laughs> one for the team. Your endurance is increased by one. Okay, I'll take one for the team, all right. Just one. For the team. And no one will be able to say anything about it, because I did it for the team. Bobble. Aw, oh, we could do a disco playthrough for Squaintcast. I've been enjoying all these, uh, the, the last, uh, the current game that we're on, The Devil in Me. I've been enjoying the idea of just, like, reacting to people talking. Because that's been pretty fun. And, uh, Disco Elysium is all voice acted. And we- I know we'd get some, like, neat reactions out of that one. I, I like Disco a lot. I think that'd be a fun idea. There's all these games, so many games to play. I want to play them all, because they're so fun. With friend. Crazy physical playthrough or s something. I agree. I was thinking that's one of the playthroughs I want to do the most, is a fully physical one. Because you could just... Essentially, the biggest, you know, perk of that is so you don't have to deal with measure head. You can just get through that plot point pretty quickly with, with like, 10 strength or whatever. I feel like that's, like, the biggest hurdle in that playthrough is just having to deal with measure head. That, yes, that asshole. I feel like everyone else in the game is, like, tolerable, at at the very least, compared to Measurehead, who's just, you know, <laughs> the worst of the worst. I do find it funny that originally, when I was talking to him, I didn't understand what he meant by, like, Al Algu Hall, where his, he had, like, an accent that made it sound silly, the way he said alcohol. And I think that's, like, one of the things that you can, like, what is it? Encyclopedia to understand. <laughs> but if you fail it, you, you continue not to understand what he means by alcohol. I saw some streamer, I think, Bausch, end up 
going off on some... Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my God. Of course he would. <laughs> that's the problem with that part of the game. <laughs> it's like that. That's like the least penetrable part when it comes to like a streamer playing that game. It's because they have to talk about that stuff. And like it's it's it really uh really shines a light, I guess. <laughs> well, actually. Awful. No. There's no well I'm um, actually for that. No. Thank you, political streamer. I know I knew I could count on you. <laughs> uh And of course there's a lot of politics in that game, which is really neat. There's a lot of like big issues that I think it's they always touch on and really interesting and like Usually, like, I mean, Measurehead's an ex uh, an exception, I guess, because he's very, like, you know, on the head, blunt with what he what his ideals are. But besides him, there's a lot of stuff like the, I think the crypto fascist, I think, is one of the characters where it's kind of like iffy on what's what his intentions are. But if you read between the lines, it's so like obvious. It's it's really neat. Or it's these big topics where like, okay, so. The reason he's acting like this is because he <laughs> this is his title and this is what he's going for and uh <laughs> he really plays it out out in the crypto aspect he's trying to be vague about what he's really rooting for and then uh <laughs> it's cool that the paths you can go on with these people like like with kuno there's a whole entire weird path you can go on with kuno where um I don't want to spoil it, I guess, too much, but just, like, Kuno becomes a pretty big part of the game later on, out of nowhere. Like, when it's so unexpected. Alright, it's decided the next Quake cast is Disco, yes! That'd be fun. Start working on the- oh my gosh. Yeah, I was Squinta, Harry. Oh my god, and the Goat Kim, I love it. Oh, that's so precious. I'm so happy, Maple got me- the, um, a Kim jacket for my birthday. No, was it? No, it was, it was for, uh, I said my birthday. It was for Christmas. I love looking at it. I have it in this room. Somewhere I can always see it. Goat Kim. For Christmas. Definitely wasn't stretching and yawning there. Nope. Can't catch me being tired. At 5 a.m. <laughs> Won't catch his ass tired. <laughs> catch you outside though, how about that? Put Jack away. Put Vengeance away. Jeez, that DPS. It's a, uh... It's this thing. 128 at full repair, or this one is so 161 not at full repair. Oof. Tempted to carry that around. Even though it's 18 pounds. Sterling. Uh, Enclave. He's fully repaired. Nope. Cool. People come here for the item management, but walk away with hilarious raccoon based humor. I'm sorry that I have to add commentary to my item management. I know. I know. We'll get through this. Oh, I need to sell some of these. I have too many of these. I mean, five too many, specifically. Uh, put away two of these in here. Why not? Why not? Let's walk around. People come here? <laughs> in my chat? It's good to see you alive. 
Not currently. I feel like that's not this stream. Maybe in different streams they would, though. I am well, sir. This makes a good background for your desktop. Teddy bear heaven. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, sorry, you're at the wrong stream. Maybe, maybe later, though. <laughs> Obviously, this is the the stream for group farting. Very different. Very different stream. There's no way those two can have a crossover. Anyway. One, two, three, four, five, six more. Well. <laughs> Couldn't let that slide now, could you? <laughs> okay, we'll put that away. Knowing my co-host here, there's no way they could let something slide. That's not how we work. Um. Oh, saying slide reminded me how in in Welcome to in Fall Guys, Icon. there's like a whole. Uh, can't wait. There's a whole like group of games that aren't even in the game right now. I'm thinking of the sliding games, where you have to slide through, uh, the hoops and everything. Remember that? Those levels? Where you had to slide down sh Oh, there, there is one! I forgot, right, there is... There is one sliding-based game that's still in the game pretty often. But there's the one with the rings that just isn't in the game right now. Looking to trade? There's sex jokes to be made, yes. <laughs> I'll dig it till my fingers are raw to find it. Just like when I, oh boy. <laughs> Tell me what you need. Raw Maybe was a good I choice of word there. Hoop shoots, yeah, that's the one. <laughs> Fun fact, Saint. There's been like a situation in this game where like other animals that are fighting might accidentally, you know, bonk a few cows here and there. But once I saw that happen, one of the cows getting knocked out. I had to learn the console command to resurrect animals, or resurrect NPCs. So now I know how to bring them back to life, and I will every time I encounter one. Oh, good. We're looking for this guy. Looking to trade? Damn right you did, yes. Nothing but the every time I see one of those ladies passed out on the in the come. wild, I'm always there to give them a hand. Nice. Rake. Save the cows. Mm -hmm. That's my main mission in the wasteland. Gotta save the moos. No. Okay. Try to do this in a way that won't scroll the chat. This old ass game can't help itself. Oh, the, the weapons I sold them just disappeared. Cool. A pleasure doing business with you. <gasps> Maple getting McChampkin. Thought I'd want to update you. Oh my gosh. That's big news. McChampkin. I'm just texting Maple. Hi. It's very important, folks. I'm texting a cow. Thank you for the update, Crazy mate. Crazy Wolfgang's got just what you need. It's a very important update. Oh, 
Oh, I need this. Oh, there she is. Watching this in the McDonald's parking lot, lot literally. Aw. I've not missed a single one still. Congrats. Ah, <laughs> my throat. <laughs> oh, geez, Squ Squint, you need to text her. She's here. <laughs> yes. Aw. I'm glad to see you here, Maple. Nothing but the highest quality. Number one fan, Moopa. And crap. Thanks for joining. I'm glad you can make it. I'm glad you're getting your chicken sandwich. Finally. Been a long time coming. Just selling all these hands. Got handed to you. <sighs> it's okay. If if you miss one of these streams, you, you miss things like that. Hand-based jokes. Oh, the stream audio is pretty crisp in your car. Whoa, it's pretty exciting. I like how you're pretty much having a phone call with me. <laughs> Just putting me on your car as Bluetooth. Thanks. Thanks. Spanks. Hmm. This is a pretty balanced uh, D and D character, right? I'm pretty sure this is this looks balanced right here. Just uh, you know, this is what you want your player to be, right? You want your player to be at full stats. <laughs> it's Cody's B drill. <laughs> Oh, I can do this now. Um, that was it. Reset. Um, I think it is. First day. Good. I also learned how to reset health. See, look at this. Pack ramen. See that health not full? Look at this. Look what I can do. Select. Bam. Now their health is full. Whoa. Good. That's a that's the what I can do with my uh medicine at a hundred. The ability to help these cows. Full health cow, he's a vet. <laughs> Yay. Very cute. Okay. Oh I still need to sell these, god damn it. <laughs> so many. Nineteen pounds worth. Currently living on like, like infinite, st infinite stealth boy with my special cheating armor. Just need to get rid of all that junk. Uh, there are not too many merchants in this game. You think that there are, but there aren't really. Let's go to ten penny. 19 pounds, like 25 bucks, it's true. Um. Oh, I guess I'm locked out. Give me a second, keep your panties on. You know what? I'll keep them on and I'll keep them in a bunch. Don't get your panties in a, in a wad. <laughs> Assuming you're wearing panties at all, I'll take. <laughs> What? Forgot this is a... Just like a metro axis? What is this? What? There's just this creepy ass place that's here? I never knew this. Don't remember actually. Oh. I can just <laughs> unlock it. Okay. That's convenient. See, that's how they can get in. The ghouls for the quest they haven't finished yet. Wow. Somewhat a flaw in their security. Even though it is a very hard lock. Back for the best? No, I'm back for the rest, actually. Got her ass. Yurkied. <laughs> Yurky. Yurky in the chat. Into 
learn math. Throw the 10 stealth boys. I won't need them. This music's so goofy. Infinite elevator music. Like I'm in Metaton. It's been a pleasure. I'm a stealth this. man. <laughs> I'm no longer stealth boy. You like these? None the wiser. None the Pfizer. Well, what's the status of Moy Phillip and his gang? Um, none. Yes. None ya. Lost karma for being a VIP. True. Hey, Hi, Shakes. Thirsty. Want bottle. Thirsty. Ooh, 100, 100 caps per. Good deal. to see you morning uh, there there must be somewhere safe out there <laughs> are, are you are you a shop or not there, i guess there not there must be somewhere safe out there this music's just rolling around in my head Okay, I'm a few pounds lighter, I think. Could get rid of these seven pounds. Okay. Um. Frick it. I think I'm gonna just explore a little lamplight and then call it a night. I keep saying little lamplight, I think that's what it's called. It's just called lamplight. No, it is called little lamplight. It's the next part for the quest. The main story quest, picking up the trail. Gotta do that thing that my papa want to do. Get the geck and save the day. Feels pretty freeing to be down just to the missions. There's just a little less exploring I still want to do, but outside of that exploring and then filling in the map, we're pretty, pretty set on like doing the DLCs and then finishing the game. Not too much more left in our Fallout adventure. Probably be done by like episode 30. At this rate. Hello. Hold it right there, mister. Don't take another Mayor. step or we'll blow your fucking head off. Oh my god. <laughs> Got a lacuna over here. What's the next solo squint stream plan? Ooh. I have a few ideas in the works. Fall at New Vegas? No. I I'm gonna take a fallout break for a while, I think. Um I don't need to be the fallout streamer. Um I have a few ideas. I have that one thing that I want to do that I thought I might do like just as a episode upload instead of on stream because I feel like it might work better just to just to uh, I, I don't think this the media needs streamer interact or audience interaction. I was thinking of uploading uh, this one game called Kentucky Route Zero, which was just this indie game that was produced in like five episodes plus like five other ins uh, supplemental games. And uh, they're, they're pretty compact. I feel like each episode is like an hour or two long. And it's just this cool little art game that's really pretty. It, it uses like vector graphics pretty much, which is pretty cool. Like all the lines are really clean. 
and uh it has this just this tone that's so nice sounds fun yeah kentucky route zero it's by this like company that pretty much only made that game and that's it and there's it, it was a pretty small company too i think it was like if i recall like three people oh annapurna they published it oh cool they did okay yeah Right, I know they publish good stuff. I know that logo. I'm just curious to see what games though I know. All these little indie games, and yeah, they publish Stray, Neon White. Nice. Oh, oh yeah, Stray and Nimona. Oh my gosh, cool. Right, I always forget that they did Nimona too. The game, Nimona. <laughs> Nominated for an Oscar. Well, hold it there, I'm a friend. You're big, I don't have any big friends. You better just go out the way you came in. That, uh, hmm. That's one way of putting it. Uh, I really need to get to Vault 87. You know the way? It's not safe, even for someone as brave as you. Huh. There's monsters back there. Monsters. The way he talks, just his nose expands every single time. Monsters? What monsters? The big ones. You know, the ones that sort of look like people, except they're all wrong. <laughs> oh, okay, you're making a lot of sense. Welcome, <laughs> market player voice. The Vault of 87? <laughs> yes. God. Thank you, Saint. I'm just thinking about you having said that if this was squint cast. <laughs> it's the Vault of 87. <laughs> so you know the way to get there. Yeah, I do. But it's through Little Lamplight, and you're not getting into Little Lamplight. Uh-uh. Guess you better find some other way, Mungo. Huh. Gain entrance. Can I come in? Hell no! No mungos allowed! Child at heart. You know what? Your face looks like my butt. <laughs> okay, this is unique dialogue because I have this perk. Oh yeah? You must like having such a good looking butt. <laughs> yeah, your mom sure likes it. <laughs> You're pretty funny <laughs> for a mungo. <laughs> With no mouth movement. In. Wow. That's all it took. <laughs> Cool. Happy birthday, Sticky. Oh no. Sorry I missed your party. Yeah, me too. Look, I don't just let any We get to see what happens when you become a Mungo. I'm taking a risk making an exception for you. So you're welcome in my town. At Aww. least until you start screwing up. Once that bullshit starts, you're out on your own again. That's very cute. You said you can tell Charlie's here because the reacts are popping off. Yay. I like doing reacts too. <laughs> Goat Pog. Not planning on starting any trouble. Good. Better stay that way, Mungo. Uh, how do you keep this place organized? Organized? Have you walked around this place? It's pure <laughs> anarchy. I wouldn't have it any other fucking way. We can't all stay here forever. This guy's got a kuno mouth on him. Eventually. And there's not much to look forward to out there. So we have a good time while we're here. And the occasional ruthless little bastard like me make sure it doesn't fall apart for the <laughs> other kids. Good work. Mc McCready. Cole Cassidy. Um. How do you get to be in charge of this place, anywho? It's not that complex. Any kid can say they want to be mayor here. It's just that most don't want to bother with the responsibility of leading. Most of the time, they last until the kids get tired of them. Then they get kicked out on their ass by the new mayor. One only lasted five minutes. Oh, shit. Of course, I've kept this place going strong for three years. Whoa. To most kids, that makes me mayor for fucking life. <laughs> Fine by me, I say. That's a very good joke, Saint. I I applaud you for finding that there, but it is unfortunate that Kuno is a kid, so I agree. <laughs> that is uh, de definitely a, a cursed, or what is it, a double-edged sword there. I was going to go the, the uh, 
the monk route to say it's a, a blessing and a curse, but I feel like that's giving it too much credit. Um, I wouldn't want to give you that much credit, now would I? You said everyone has to leave eventually. <laughs> People change. No, you're right. It's cursed. <laughs> we don't trust mungos living down here, so we leave for a place called Big Town before we get too old. At hmm. least that's the line Joseph teaches. Joseph. But really, we simply don't have enough space or food for everyone to stay here forever. Oh, really? That's why. So I've got to exile some to avoid ruining the whole town. We've been to Big Kit Town it's really early hard, on. Fucking brutal choice to make, but that's the way we stay alive. This is really fucking. That's all I need to know. About. Who are you? I'm McCready. I run Little Lamplight because they made me the mayor. And I they don't made like me mayor. Or Mungos. They made me John Mayor. Can you give me directions? What do I look like? Your tour guide? Okay, then no. Sorry. Right. <laughs> and don't come back. Uh, I said sorry. I guess I'm going to be a sorry cop archetype. There's nothing happy about it. This is the worst day of my life. It's time to go. You know the rules. The rules look at this mole. Stupid. You're a mungo now. You gotta leave. Maybe I can stay just a little longer? <laughs> Look at this shrunken down yeah. like adult model. Well, don't just stand there. What's Get out of here already. Fun times and laughs as always. Dog. Okay, then. Princess. I know oh, that's name. Oh, they're Rex, not Princess. I thought the dog's name was Princess. Let's talk to Sticky. Wow. What luck. What luck. I'm Sticky. Forget these little kids. I'll take you to Big Town where the Mungos, I mean, where the grown ups live. Yeah, the shading on the faces. Now. On his face <laughs> makes him look like a who from Whosville. <laughs> from Whoville. Da Who Dore. Um, that's a, that is a big thing about this game. There's lots of caves and lots of horrible lighting on faces. You get, get, get in many situations where for some reason the only part that's lit on them is this specular glint that's on their eyes, just giving them creepy pasta faces. Or who faces. Both both pretty uh similar. Dr. Pepper. Banter. Pep Z. <laughs> Coca-Cola. Thank you, Maple. Uh, where are the grown-ups at? Big town. You've never heard of it? Big town. It's where all the grown-ups go. Well, at least when they grow oh, up. Maple's and home. Out Good. A Welcome home, whoops. I can show you the way. There's no reason to waste your time with a bunch of snot-nosed kids. Got Let's two go McChimkins, now. a large fly, Dr. Pepper, and McNuggets. Wow. She feast. I'm so glad she gets Monch. It's been a long time coming. Fine, I'll take you to Big Town, but first I need to visit Lil... Nah. Got any capsule. <laughs> I'll squirt you to Big Town, but it'll cost you. You're on your own. I'll do the first one, I guess. I'm fine with taking him there. Um... Let's let's extort this kid. Um, yeah, I got lots of cats, huh. but they um, pop cat they're at Big Town, Munch. so I can give them to you when we get there. Yeah, take huh. me to Big Town, and you'll get your reward. My girlfriend Red has lots of caps. Oh boy! I'll wait for you outside, unless you want to go now. What's with the party hat? Oh, I wonder why. I forgot I had that on. It was for my birthday. His birthday. Here, you take oh. it. I don't want it anymore. Yes, Pog. Big Town, I've been there before. You have? I mean, of course you have. It's an awesome place. Well, enough talking. Let's get a move on. You are taking me to Big Town, right? All right. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Big Town. Wow. Come. Real animation. What are the steampunker okay. over there? Hey. <laughs> All right, then. What are you so happy are about? Are we there yet? <laughs> Didn't mean to bother you, princess. Yeah, run along and cry. <laughs> he did run along. Okay, bye. It is to be seen if he cries yet. Why is this taking so long? <laughs> Are you lost? Delish. Bathtub. Just in case you're curious. A story to pass the time. Oh God. Once upon a time, there was this dog. His name was Super Dupe Dave, and he went all around rescuing people from super mutants and slavers and, and other nasty things. Super Dupe Dave. And one day, Add to the a Wikipedia. giant ant came up to him and started talking like he wasn't some dumb ant, 
but a person of some kind. It said, prepare to die. And was our brave hero Prepare to die edition, Fallout, no, or Dark Souls? not at all. He left in the face of danger. Ha, ha, ha. He beat up the monster and everyone cheered. The end. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks, Sticky. That was really good. Uh... Large town. Where are you? There it is. Wow, it's pretty far away. There it is. We're almost there. Come on. Yippee! Yippee! <laughs> um, did, don't you have something to say? Yeah. I made it to Big Town. Big Town. Hooray! And now, one of my inspirations. Uncle Red. I was starting to think that Big Town wasn't a very good place to live. Oh, but God. I think the lighting in here. Thanks to you. <laughs> this is the town, right? We're all... We're all... Where are the, where are the stores at? I guess adults don't go to stores that much. <laughs> that must be why there isn't anything here. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> good emote. Your fly's open. Ha <laughs> ha! Made you look. <sighs> that's okay. I got the party hat. I guess that's the reward. Any idea why there are barricades around the town? Well, I don't know. I guess the grown up. I've already done the quest here. I know why. Brats always hanging around them. It's I invaded by it. super mutants all the time. <laughs> made you creepier. <laughs> Big town changed you. It definitely did make him creepier. He was already there creepy. He is. I don't think I, hey, yeah. I don't think Red will give me anything, but I might as well just see if there's any like quest there. Quest finish up here. We did it! You did it! This is definitely you Moira's voice. You defeat the mutants. Oh, we'll all feel safer now. Thank you so much. Okay, nope. <laughs> He's just lied about the caps. Yeah, of course. I, mean, I wasn't expecting him to. Actually, uh. Give them to me. Welcome. My girlfriend Red. Never heard of him. Never heard of her. Move along, please. Oh, cool. You know what? He's been a good boy. Full health. <laughs> the only way to check his health after he's full health is just to sadly to target him in vats. Sorry to cut off that angelic background music that you might have not been able to hear. Lots of oh going on in it. Um <laughs> What artist at Bethesda got out the like MS paint and wrote these with their mouse? Like, this is mouse writing right here. Great. Souvenirs. Uh, essentials, actually. Beautiful. Hi, everyone. Hey. Hi, Bumble. Whoa! You're oh big! Oh my god, it's terrifying. You must be the biggest <laughs> kid here. I'm the littlest kid. My real name's Betty. But mostly I get called Bumble. I can't what look at you, you I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, wow, cool. Sometimes people call me Vault Dweller. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you, too. Did you come from the vault? I heard there's monsters down there. Wow. The player told me once, one of them, they got him and bit him right in the face. And that's why he's only got one eye. Mm. You don't look like a monster. And I don't think you'd bite anyone in the face. You look like a nice Vault Dweller. Look, it was 2008, folks. They didn't know how to model back then. Just, just the lighting is so awful in here. God. We need to get into the vault, you know the way? We don't go there. It's bad back there. Ask Mayor if you really want to know. Why do they call you Bumble? It's just a name, okay? 
Hmm. Now so my I... fault I knocked stuff over. Oh. Lucy says, I still got a lot of growing to do. Got lots of growing to do. Uh, directions. I don't know. I still get lost sometimes. Things are really big. <laughs> the bike okay, so you're playing a child. Everything to you is big because you're small. <laughs> That's your motivation. What's going on here? Who are you? Uh, <laughs> I legit thought she had like a smoking cigarette animation for a sec. You're new, and you're too big to be a resident. Who are you? Apparently I'm a child at heart. Oh, I actually did do this. You brought back Penny and Sammy and Squirrel? Well, I guess that does make you a pretty big hero. Thanks. I'm Lucy, and I'm pretty much the mom around them. here. And that means I spend a lot of time kissing boo-boos and making things all better. So if you I think my character's 17 or 19? I forget. Or if you get shot, stabbed, or radiated, stop by, and I'll do what I can, big hero. Oh, cool. You're a... sweet. Sure can. Oh, pay you. <laughs> yeah, when you run out of ideas for kids' names after two. Squirrel, that'll do. <laughs> That's just how we name kids here in America, Saint. You have duck, you have squirrel, you have hamster. It's, it's classic children names. Give me directions. Well, what? Okay, find a doctor. Yeah, that's me. I'm only on duties when I'm in the office. Trader. There's a souvenir shop just north of the entrance. Styrofoam <laughs> raccoon. Whatever else we can't use. Check there. <laughs> yeah. You can only get there through murder paths. Oh, God. And we keep guards there to keep the little kids out. But if you want to have a look, it's north of the souvenir shop. Nope. Grub. Right here. Oh. Welcome to our fungus pools. Eat <laughs> Cool. How do you keep healthy here? There's always one big sister or another who knows her way around a compress and a sewing needle. So we take care oh. of most of the little scrapes. And way back when... Someone figured out that some of the plants and fungus around here <laughs> absorb radiation. The little ones don't like to eat their veggies, but they don't like to be sick either. So we get by. Wow. <laughs> My beautiful voice, Styro, don't ask what it's short for. It sounds like you're, uh, it sounds like it's pretty useful fungus. It is, especially for dealing with the low-level radiation we all get from the water. Hmm. The fungus just soaks it right up. Yay. But it doesn't help the rickets that keep hitting the younger lamp. Oh, God. Believe it or not, I can make a treatment for that from extract of buff out. Oh. Actually, if you can talk McCready into it, I'd be glad to trade some fungus for buff out. But he'd have to say it was okay. Oh, cool. So you're the only doctor. Well, we all know the basics. Combat first aid, you know? <laughs> but I've got the most experience at the tough stuff. Bumble's been learning the most about the more complex parts of cutting and sewing. People tease her, but she's got a steady hand. Of course, now she just needs to learn what you do and don't cut. Hmm. Well? Thanks. Hopefully, it'll just be skin, knees, and bloody noses today. Hopefully. Fine, I won't rob children, I guess. For now. Ooh. Doctor, is it? Thanks, Lucy. Oh, it's her name's Lucy. Oh my god. The doctor is in, and her name's Lucy. It's, it's a peanuts joke. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you okay, Lucy? Well. <laughs> Uh, that's that's one way to slide your character around, I guess. Um, she's so talented. <laughs> Aw. That's cute. Cool again. Said Rory from the TTRPG runs this joint to Nayu. Yeah. 
Knock knock. New in town, huh? Well, if McCready let you in, that's a good sign. I'm not. I'm glad my Pip Boy's light is on. It's helping the with the lighting. Or at least the morale. So who are you? You going to cause any trouble? Wow. Can't believe I have to say a cab to this kid. Um. I rescued some of your friends from yeah. Oh, that was you. <laughs> nice work. I hope you got some good laughs out of it before you left. <laughs> Gotta make sure they know not to try that again. Speaking of which, I'm knock knock. That and I take care of the general morale around here. Again, okay. Just to say, I collect a lot of stories. Poor kid, worst name. <laughs> to keep the others amused. Morale's better F. than less Al, see? F7 in the chat. She charge him morale. Mor Miles Morales. What does that mean? Well, technically, I'm patrolling and keeping the peace. Mostly, that involves making oh, sure seven. people are happy and not getting into trouble. You can't very well keep the peace if you've already lost it, see? So, bam. Joke. Bam. Want to hear one? Oh, God. We're in luck. Sure, let's hear one. Prepare to be amused. <laughs> Me at my <laughs> chat. Prepare to be amused. <laughs> this is stupid. Who's there? Noah. Know a place where you can get some better jokes. <laughs> That's only possible with intelligence. Remember, folks, jokes <laughs> use your intelligence stat. Hey, that's good. Uh, I was just gonna say, no, a place where I can get some food. <laughs> that was hysterical. That was, um, really funny. <laughs> Need high IQ to understand jokes. What, what, what's the difference between these? Why would I... Which, which one is... <laughs> Which one's the real lie? That was hysterical. That was, um, really funny. Gee, thanks. I have to admit, most of them aren't really funny. At least not ha-ha funny. <laughs> They're more like a tradition. Most of them were passed down from this book we found down back, called Vault Boy's Big Book of Laughs for Kids. Wow. They're not really funny, but something about hearing them is That's where I learned company, my humor, you know? too. Why don't you come up with new jokes or stories to tell? Oh, we've got lots of funny incidents. Like when Sammy shot the raider who thought he was a girl. That sort of stuff. What? <laughs> but we don't really get a lot of new stories from outside. The scav teams spend all their time hidden. So they don't oh. get much news, see? I'd you sure see? like to hear more tales from the great big outdoors myself. Actually, if you hear any, feel free to I, tell me. I've done, gone on like every single quest. I got a tale I could tell you. Oh, really? Tell me about it. Not long ago, my father left me, so I went searching for him. I left my dull life behind to search for fame and adventure in the wasteland. Long ago, my people were buried away, and now I have risen to terrorize the wastes. Story time, so uh, let's let's go with fame and fortune. Adventure. Wow, that sounds like it took some guts. Oh, life down here might get dull. Give them Moira's book. But I gotta admit, at least I don't get shot at. Well, not as much anyway. <laughs> Tell me more. What's happened since then? Um. <laughs> the wasteland is littered with victims of my vengeance and amusement. Uh, I enlisted the aid of the Brotherhood of Steel in my heroic adventures. They work for you? Well, they must think you're the most important Mungo in the wastes. So what happens next? <laughs> yeah, I'll just tell you more of I'm still working on the ending. That makes sense, I suppose. A good story can take a while to put together, you know. I called Knock Knock. Well, when people started calling Nikki by his new name, I needed one too, see? If you're twins, it just doesn't cut it to be called Nick Knack and Sue. <laughs> Nick Knack and Knock Knock? Okay. Directions. To where, man? To where, man? Doctor? You know that office building near the entrance? When Lucy's at work in there, she's the one who patches this up. Dope. I'm probably gonna call it in like 10-ish minutes from now, by the way. It has nothing to do with this stream reaching six hours and me trying to go right under six hours for editing's sake. That's probably not the only thing that's preventing me from Streaming indefinitely. <laughs> Go 
of souvenirs for now. Sounds good. Drip, drip. Oh. Nice location. Mole. Bathrooms. Oh, teddy bear. Free. Stole a kid's teddy bear. <laughs> Great chamber. The great atrium. Or ventricle. Souvenir, you she. Thank you for the stick iguana. No one's here. Oh, it's pretty late. Maybe during the day hours. Put that in the pile of teddy bears at home. Yep. There were so many. I love them. Aw. Oh. Moment. We're in it. We're in Sam Heck. Oh, hi. Oh, it's the... Okay, so you get in, but I got my eye. You don't make any trouble in here, got it? I ain't having no shit butts making trouble. Oh my god. Not planning on starting trouble. I heard a lot about the fungus in your cavern. I'd like to make a deal. I'll... Yeah. I was going to talk to him about it, but I think there's another kid I can talk to about it. And I can, like, make a double deal where I can... have two different ways I can... pay for cave fungus. Oh. Watch it. Oh. Just Gosh, a generic kid. Squirrel. Wow, am I glad to be back? If it weren't for you, oh yeah, I saved I think him. We'd have died back there. So, thanks for the help. If anyone asks me, you're an official kid. <laughs> okay, I like you squirrel. I like to think it's because of my inquisitive and charming nature, as well as my natural climbing ability. Hmm. But knock knock says it's because I'm totally nuts. Guess which That's one's reason to call me right. squirrel, I guess. Take care. Not just nuts, I'm totally nuts. Oh, this is like ballast or whatever to or stuff for the pulley system. Okay. Princess. Hey, kid. I don't know if anyone told you yet, but let me set the record straight. I'm Princess. When you're around me, I'm in charge. You shut up and do what <laughs> I say, because I'm boss around here. That clear? Now, who are you? I see where they got the inspiration for Craig, Craig of the Creek. This whole place is just Craig of the Creek, but in the Fallout universe. It's because of my fat nuts! Thank you, Sh Thanks, Shmate. You know what's up. Um, <laughs> no one else does. Uh... <laughs> oh, I'll, that, I'll just say whatever you say. Good. Glad we got that settled. Stay out of my way and there won't be any problems. Uh, what's it like guarding the back gate? <laughs> it's so dull. Practically nothing ever tries to come through the back gate anymore, so I never get to shoot anyone. <laughs> I wish I was at the front gate, but RJ specifically put me back here. Up front, at least there's a chance I can shoot some unwanted visitors. Which could have included you, Mungo. This kid knows what's fun. Why would have you shoot me? <laughs> Could have been a lot of reasons. Why would have you Maybe shot you at me? Like a monster in all that darkness. Why would Maybe have? Maybe had a weapon drawn and looked like a raider. Maybe I just decided I didn't like your stupid Mungo face. Okay, fair reasons to end a life. How did someone like you get the name nickname like Princess? I don't need to explain myself to you, Mungo. Shut up and get lost. <laughs> in fact, don't you ever bother me about something as stupid as nicknames again. Wow. I missed my chance as a kid to be, like, this rude. No, it's <laughs> Graham. Well, thank... Okay. Well, I'm not getting past this like this. Swirl, come back here. Watch it. 
Thanks for getting Penny and Squirrel back. And Sammy too, I guess. <laughs> okay, so they have something against Sammy, I guess. Bathroom. Okay. Typical bathroom. This room sure has a bath in it. It does. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna find me one more person to talk to and then I'm gonna call it a night. We'll pick up back. Pick back up here. We'll pick up sticks here. Watch it! Watch it. Excuse me. Food. Whoa. Delicious water. Oh, radio. This is just the Thieves Guild in Riften. Hey. Knickknack. Paddywhack. You have a dog a bone. Watch it. Watch it. I'll talk to Nick Knack and then call it a night. Honk shoe time. Me 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 hours. Yeah. You in town, huh? If McCready let you in, that's good enough for me. Well, cool. enough with formalities. Who are you? And how'd you get McCready to let you in here? Her <laughs> bitter rivals in my head cannon. That's funny. Like all twins should be. I'm from Vault 101, and I rescued some of your friends from the slavers. Well, that was By you. the way, nice work. I hope one of you grabs some of their gear. Um, actually, you left. gotta make them pay for something like that. True. Speaking of which, I'm Nick Knack, and I take care of the general store around here. Which is to say, I collect a lot of stuff, and sometimes trade it for other stuff. That's pretty much a store. See? Hmm. Really broke it down for me there. Why they call you Nick Knack? Well, my name was Nick. And I collect knickknacks. Wow. Not everything has to be real complex, see? This kid has it really worked out. Can you repair something? Sure. Cool. Don't need that repaired, but cool. Um. Wait, you can... We don't go there. It's bad. Where to, man? <laughs> Whenever I'm at my treasure trove in the souvenir shop, oh. I'll sell whatever you're looking for. Okay. It's to the west of the entrance. Look for the grotto with the pools and stuff. That's where I am. Okay. Oh, okay. Wow, he really didn't have much to say. Oh. Eclairs. Are you Eclair? One of you? No. Oh, hi. Hey. Watch it. Hey. Watch hey. it. Hey. Watch it. Hey. Hey. Watch it. Okay me on Twitter whenever I stream. Hey, watch it. Okay, well, that was all pretty wacky and fun. Another successful stream, I think. Um, Make sure to rate it on Yelp. Be honest. Um, Thanks again for joining. I really appreciate everyone coming out. Honk shoe time. It's been really fun, everyone. Have a good night. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you in the next one. Good night. Bye bye. Honk shoo. Mimi.